Good afternoon, good morning. I hope you are well and welcome to Masterclass where we talk about all things, not just crafty. For a moment ago, we were talking about with the winter when you do your washing, do you hang it up inside? Do you peg it outside on the washing line? What do you do? Because I put mine outside sometimes but then it doesn't dry, it does for others. So all these different random conversations that we have when it comes to Crafters TV, what do you do? Do you do it inside or outside? Let us know in the comments. However, this is all about Masterclass. This is all about our numbers and alphabets. It's not just me though. We've got the one, we've got the only phenomenal, she's at the tail end after not feeling 100%, but she is doing absolutely fine. I know she's had lots of lovely comments saying, Debbie, are you okay? Oh, that's really kind of you. Yes, I'm fine, thank you. I'm fine. Just we've just been having this conversation with Christina in the kitchen. Oh. <laughs> I just saying, you get to a certain age and things start to go a bit downhill. Uh, however, <laughs> <laughs> just so I don't what's going on? What's going on? Before I start, so just clear things up. I mean, <laughs> everything is fine. I'm not going to announce anything. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> and I got a daily dose of Ben. And yeah, because I've just seen in. Ben outside, so that was lovely to see because I've not seen him for ages. So I've just had, I've just had one of those quick, you know, shot in. Is it shot in the arm? They call it a pick it up. Tonic, 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 a tonic. Yeah, a top up tonic. Top up tonic. Top up tonic. We'll call it that. Uh, it's a good job. I think we should have warned Tom when I'm like actually before <laughs> well, we started. What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you were shot in your arm, Debbie. <laughs> But we've got a great show lined up for you. It is a masterclass and it is going to be about numbers and alphabets. And I've got lots of different styles. Um, I've got the fabulous ones that create your own shaped number card bases with the use of the dies and the stencils so they can be used in a multiple uh, usage way. Um, I've also got left fold. And I say what we've got left of the left fold, I shall actually say. Um, I've got a little nod to something that's going to be fast approaching. Hello to 2000. 23 which is Ooh. just around the corner uh, so we've got that lined up for you we've got some shadow alphabets but I've gone with a more subtle shadow effect with this one and then we've got some multimedia dies that are not necessarily just for multimedia because you can turn it into your card making as well so I've done a little cutesy little uh, abacus there um, and that's what I've got lined up for you in these next two hours. But it's not just me and Craig, because mm -hmm. there's someone else with us, isn't there, Craig? We do indeed. Now, we have... Now, I'm going to say it was kind of four of us, because there's some little gremlins about again, just making that clear. However, what we do have and who we do have is... You may have seen him within Wake Up Call, but he's back once again. It's Tom from Wilso with our plantable books and Hi. other things. How you doing? You're right. How's it going? Oh, I was interested in your conversation earlier, Craig. Uh -huh. So, when you're washing, do you use plastic pegs or wooden pegs? Uh, plastic, <laughs> I've got. There you go. Yeah. Then, yeah. 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 I, sh I should invest in uh, the wooden ones. Yeah, sure. they're there, yeah. sorry. <laughs> um, so many people in the comments earlier on, Tom, just saying how they love idea, this idea. Many seen you the first time round that you came on, but you've come back again. Some of the items you'll have seen before, but you've got a few new items, just briefly, because we're going to come back to you and have a chat. What is it about exactly that you I'll brought? be really quick then. So, let's pop them out. so we have... Gift, plantable gift tags, so you can put them on your uh, Christmas presents or you're even going to use little decorations for you. Uh, and then we also have an exclusive for crafters today, oh, wow. for all the super duper crafters out there. We actually have uh, some plain stock paper, which is wildflower, but oversized A4, so it's 225 by 320 millimetres, and you can create anything out here. And there's lots, about a thousand seeds in that one sheet there. Brilliant. If you want to know more, we are going to be going across to Tom just there, uh, not that too long away where we're going to delve into what Tom's brought to us today and exactly what you can be doing with it all. But first and foremost, what we do want to do is we want to show you some incredible deals that we've still got across on our website. And this one is limited stock. It is your Gemini alphabet and number die collection with 110 dies, £17 or $25. You are saving over 20%, but look at your platinum price, comes down to £13.60 or $20. So that is for your alphabet and number dies. So each of these has a matte and layer die with it. So you've got that one, limited stock, £13.60 or $20.
then we're also going to be having a look at the left fold alphabet you know what I'm like these are the ones that I love to use as a standalone alphabet I just chopped them out Debbie showed us earlier on how to use them we'll have a look again but these are 93 elements 37 pound 10 or 49 dollars 48 look at that saving 37 pound 86 or 50 dollars 48 on the today's price but platinum price comes all the way down to 29.68 or 39 dollars 58 maybe you want some big numbers zero all the way to nine we have got our large number expression die and stencils you've got stencils with each of these 10 piece in total although kind of more than that it's 10 number dies is that one two three four five six seven eight nine is that nine number dies eight ten number dies just having a conversation with myself there however with each die you do get a stencil as well gives you different matinee options 23 pound or 38 dollars once again look at that saving 56 pound 90 or 91 dollars 50 that is a 70 yeah 70 percent saving look at your platinum price 18 pound 40 or 30 dollars 40. then maybe you want to have a look at your multi-craft alphabet number and punctuation dies so you've got three packs and in total you are going to be getting 73 dies 69 pound or 81 dollars fab saving on your multi-craft alphabets at 50 pound 97 or 53 dollars 85 but of course your uh, club inspire and if you're platinum you're going to be paying less than that 55.20 or 64 dollars 80 that is for your multi-craft alphabet 73 dies in total and these are your slightly deeper dies so they're going to cut a multitude of different alphabets so as you can see, it really is a masterclass that is all about our numbers and alphabets. What we also have going as well, certainly today, with it being day number five, we are in the midst of our 12 days of Craftmas event. And that means every day, for instance today, if you spend 20, so that's 20 pounds, 20 dollars or 20 euros, you're going to be getting your cardstock luxury, precious metal cardstock completely free. So as long as your order is £20, $20 or €20 Euros or more, that will be popped into your basket and it will be popped into your pass, your, uh, into, your, into your order, that's what I'm trying to say. Uh, Johnny was just saying that it's already been busy when it comes to uh, people getting your freebie of your cardstock, but then the numbers were a way to look at again. That's why I was like, how much has gone? So... This is what you are going to be getting free. It is 40 sheets. It's our luxury card stock, precious metals, and that is completely free. You've got some shedless glitter. You've got some self-adhesive glitter. You've also got some mirror. And of course, you've also got some of your matte card stock as well. Now, what we are going to be having a look at first is our large number expression die and stencils. So it's uh, saying a uh, 10 piece, you know, it's 20 if you include the stencil for each of them, £23 or $38. Platinum price is £18.40 or $30.40. Taking your eye back to that today's price, Debbie, that saving on that today's price alone is absolutely phenomenal. But then getting it at the platinum price, even less at £18.40 or $30.40 is awesome. Each stencil gives you an option of, off the top of my head, it's about three different matte and layer sizes, but enables you to create different concepts that we're going to be seeing with Debbie right now. Yeah, absolutely. And these are fabulous um, dies. These dies can cut out so you can use those. You can use these for things like your birthday banners, um, Maybe you've got your own craft stalls and you want to you know, decorate that. You could use these for that. Um, they're also for personalisation. You can make shape cards. There's a lot of things you're going to be able to do with these. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to start with um, a nice shaped card using the outer parts, which is not the dies. It's the actual stencils. And the lovely thing about these stencils, and they come as well, Craig, you've got instructions. They do, don't So they? when you open it up, this is where you get your, um, your metal die. You also get your... And it's been deliberately 
um, scaled to a larger size so that you can create those extra mats and layers with that as well as all the other different things that you could do with it which is what I'm going to show you in a second so it shows you how you can embellish how you can create your single number how you can create a double number and let's not just think of double numbers because you could do this for a year that a baby were born yeah so 2022 you could. you could absolutely do that all you would need to do is think about the size of your card and the way that you're going to use this now I'm going to make a, a 40th now I know 40th you can get in the shops so I thought I'm going to I'm going to stick with it because mm -hmm. it's still a nice shaped card yes, and I'm going to use the template now there's choices because you've got now I always think of this as you've got these lines here that you can draw around to create your first number yeah but you've got one here you've got one here you've got the inside part and you've got the outside part so you've got a lot of different mats and layers there it's That's not just true. two or three you've got you've got a multiples multiple uh, mats and layer options now I've taken a piece of multi-purpose cardstock and I've just scored it in half so this is an A4 piece of cardstock folded in half uh, what I actually going to do is just take it up to the top and just have a little bit of an overhang now okay. I'm not going to use the outside part I'm going to bring it down a little bit uh, and I'm going to use the um, inner part so this first line here I'm just going to come round and show you what I mean right. so we're going to come in I'm not going to bother with that one because I, I don't need to think about that one it's not going to be connecting you just need a pencil and an eraser and you're good to go now I am going to just do this all the way around first and then I'm going to interlock it with another number because you could do this as a singular one or as a double one or as a triple or as a quadruple or as many numbers as you want to which is what I think is great about this concept so you can see they started to form the shape yeah. of the four I'm going to be in game now bearing in mind that I've already um, done the same in terms of the first layer that's exactly what I'm going to do with this okay. but you see the potential that you have you've got a really big can you see the difference between the two do, you've you? got a really big um, option there so again I'm just going to line that up again I'm just taking it over the overhang again right. uh, I'm going to come down in and I'm just going to pop those lines back in again just like so it's all the way around because you, know, you can imagine if you had a set of dies separate matte and layer dies which you know dies always come in useful we all love them here but having the stencil it brings down large numbers to even when these launched with a reasonable price but today yeah crazy price yeah and now all we're going to do is because i've had that overhang it doesn't mean that i'm going to be snipping into the top of that what i'm just going to do is cut around now the template and you can use your larger scissors I'm going to completely ignore this so I'm going to just rub all of this out so you can take your eraser or your rubber and just rub all of that out okay. because that's going to be the formation of the card nah, so yeah. that's how we do it so you would literally just look at it this way and join those up that's all you're going to do and that literally is as easy as it is to create your own card shape so again just going to Go and in and follow those around. I'm going to turn the card uh -huh. rather than the scissors. I'm going to open my scissors as far as I can go as well and then come in and then just follow that all the way around. And it's as easy as that, Craig. That's, that's the beauty of the stencil. It, is. it really is fabulous set. Uh, and to be able to do things like this as well is just absolutely amazing. I absolutely love these. I always have... Um, we actually bought these back as because um, we've retired these, we haven't did, we? Yeah. And we mm -hmm. brought them back because people had requested it. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we brought it back at that price, Craig. I don't want to lie. No, no I don't um, think so. I don't think it was at all. Uh, but yeah, so you can see uh, they've been very popular and they still prove to be popular to this day just because of that versatility. And exactly. I'll show you some samples in a second of all the different ways that you can use them as well. So that creates me 40 shaped card base with ease. Now, Debbie, you've done that literally within minutes. Oh, yeah. Whereas if you were to see that, a finished card straight away, you'd go, I wouldn't know where to start, or if I did start it, it's going to take me a while. You didn't have any of the pencil marks done, anything nope. like that. You had your card blank, drew around it, cut it, done. Exactly. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick with stencils for now because I want a matte and layer for it. So I know that the, my card base was the first line. If I'd gone to the larger one, I would then come down into that first one. But because I started there, I know, and I'm just, I've just used some of our um, satin card stock here, but I'm going to come down into this next one. So this time, and again, just using a pencil, and you saw how easy it was. You can rub all of those um, pencil markings out after you've cut it out, um, but it just gives you the... And it, it, it's so straightforward. Mm -hmm. I know people are scared of stencils and I don't know why because they really are effective they are. and they're very very easy to use as well 
Um, and again, you'll see that that's created that number four. Don't worry about having to join it all up. Don't be doing any of that. You no. don't need to do any of that. And exactly the same with the other one. We will go in with the second row down because I know now that that is that perfect matte and layer for that card base. So again, we're going to go all the way around. And then you're going to take your scissors again. And you're just going to do exactly the same. So we're going to, I'll just make life a bit easy for myself and I'll separate the two. So straightforward. And if you, if you find it uncomfortable with the larger scissors, you can go in with the smaller ones. Um, I wouldn't use the snippy scissors, I'm not going to lie. But I think the snippy scissors are probably a little bit too small. But again, all you just do is take your scissors and cut and follow the line around the stencil. And easy it's that, that straightforward. Easy as that. It's like, it's like, it's like putting it together with numbers, isn't it? You like paint by numbers. Yes, But it's yes. so easy to achieve these looks. Uh, and again, you'll take a bit more time, obviously. I mean, I'm not that I'm rushing, but I know we've got lovely Tom coming up again very soon. Um, so literally take your time with it and you'll rub out all your markings as well. But again, just showing you how easy it is to create your four mm -hmm. and it will sit in two your car blank oh, like so and that's exactly what you will do and I did, I've done that with the other one Craig but what I'm going to do is bring in a nice nice piece of pattern cardstock <laughs> can you tell I've got a terrible thing about these beautiful I'm going to say call it an addiction because that's what it is because I absolutely love these paper pads they're just exquisite they are, so don't these they? The spring bloom, mm -hmm. the, yeah, I absolutely love them. Uh, so again, I'm just going to bring in my dies now for both of those because I know now that with my cutouts, and I'm going to go with this side. Let's uh, let's go in there and just pop that through my die cutting machine. In fact, I should be able to get that on there. The size. They are huge. huge Can I just say, they? absolutely. That's a lot of metal big brilliant numbers that I think are a statement piece um, especially if you love your scrapbooks yeah, um, yeah. and like I said bunting it could be it could be someone's wedding anniversary and you could be right, wrapping the the year it is year that you were married yeah. wrapping bun, you know bunting all the yeah. way around or it could be someone's 18th and you could be making your own 18th or 16th could, or whatever yeah. it is whatever age it is 2023 exactly so once that's cut out, that's cut my two numbers out beautifully, which then all start to come together in terms of, let me just put it back there, I've got my card base, my numbers. And like I said, I'm not going to worry about these because they're going to be mats and layers that are going to be covered up. So I'm not going to worry too much. So you can see just how perfect that all is yeah. and how easy it is to construct. So I'm start putting those together and I'll get my glue. Let me just open that up. There we go. The fact that the back is the same as the front. Yes, the that's front what I love about it. Yeah. Is the outline of the number and the yeah. back is your square card blank. Exactly. It is the front. Exactly. So again, all I'm going to do is I'll let me, I'll let me zero, me zero. Yeah, zero down first. It's good as well to, I know this might sound silly, but when we do numbers or that, we do tend to do, not strange, but numbers, uh, ages that you wouldn't find in stores. Yes. Whereas it's actually nice to see, OK, as Debbie was saying, <laughs> you see a 40 in a store, but it's not something we tend to do. We tend to say, you can get them easily, do them with your other ones, yep. but let's see what you can do. But to do an actual 40, 50, 60, you know, pink, greens, yellows, use the dies on their own, use the stencil on the own, use the stencil to create the card blank. I'm looking Lots for some things. foam pads, Craig. I don't know where... Uh, the, the, do you know, I'm looking... It's to be well, somewhere. it's been a while since I've been in here, Craig, and I know it is for you, and normally I have a stash in my bag. Like somewhere. But I've only fetched my little, um, little travel one with me today. Yeah. I haven't fetched my full kit, so I wanted to lift my numbers off to give them a little if bit of dimension. If you want to be lucky, I can do a few comments while you have a wheel look. Yes, would you be able yeah, to do that? I can. Have a little look, rummage through these drawers. Absolutely, because ah, yeah. we've got Rachel on social for uh, this Masterclass show, and she's uh, saying that uh, Clarice Strudel is saying, Hi from South Carolina. Beth is in saying good morning from sunny upstate New York. We've also, uh, Rachel is saying, so she would dry outside, but it won't dry now this time of the year, so it's the dreaded tumble dryer. Thankfully, I don't have a tumble dryer, so I, I, I'm one of those that just have my clothes, you know, on the radiator or a clothes horse next to the radiator. That's me. I do that sort of thing. 
uh, Pamela saying use the dryer, uh, Mary, Reno saying good morning, Debbie and Craig love your sweater. Loads of comments that we will start to uh, continue to read through. I know Debbie's uh, got her chunky glue, but if you do have any comments, any questions, send them through to Rachel and uh, we'll have a look at them throughout the show. Yep, I couldn't find the um, I couldn't find the foam pads, so I have got my very favourite glue, my chunky glue. So anybody think it was my glue? Way I talk about it, <laughs> but um, yeah. It is yours. <laughs> yeah. So I'm just going to pop that over the top. That'll give me some height. Obviously now it's wet glue. I'm I'm using gel glue rather than foam pads. Foam pads is instant. Gel isn't. So I need to let that dry. But I need to titivate it up a little bit. So what better way than using um, some beautiful stamped images? So I've gone with a lovely stamped image that's going to sit around the bottom of that one, and then one going across there like so. So again, I'll use my. Um, Chunky glue, I nearly said foam pads, then I'm thinking, this ain't foam pads, what am I on about? <laughs> so let's pop that on, and I've chosen the colour purple, obviously, colour of creativity, but it's also one of my favourite colours, I don't know about yourself, Greg. Um, I absolutely adore colour. purple. Um, and again, I'm just going to go in and add that around. Have you seen what the Pantone colour is for 2023? The what colour? Pantone colour. You know, uh, Pantone, the, the brand, the company, yeah. that the head of the trend, and they yeah, the yeah, yeah. yeah. kind of inform us what the, the colour trend's going to be next year. It's uh, Viva Magenta. Oh, my days. It is absolutely oh, I love magenta. off the scale. It I really, really magenta. is. I love magenta. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like a sharp, sharp pink. I, I, um, yeah, I would, yeah, I would say, yes, a very uh, bright. Yes. Bright. Yeah. Uh, but beautiful, mm -hmm. absolutely beautiful. And there you go. I need to let mine dry a little bit, obvious for obvious reasons. But there you go. I've got myself, and I'll pop it there. Let me just move all these bits out of the way because putting it on the glass mat doesn't tend to work very well. Um, but again, keeping it really nice and simple, we've created a card blank. We've created the mats and layers, and we've also popped on there that lovely um, finishing touch with those stamps. Yeah. And look at that, of course, yeah, apart from the, the stamping and the colouring, Debbie's done that in front of your eyes. That incredible card, that card blank, shape card blank, 40, it could be 42, it could be 100, it can be any number that you want. So you've seen the idea as to what uh, Debbie was showing you a moment ago, that is the large number expression die, 10 die collection. So it, it's basically, you've got 10 little sets there, each of them contain a die and a stencil that Debbie showed you how to use. All of that you're going to be getting for £23 or $38 with that phenomenal saving. Of course, if you are platinum, that's going to come down to £18.40 or $30.40. If you are just joining us right now, we are in the midst of our 12 days of Craftmas. And that means today, if you spend 20, so that's 20 pound, $20 or 20 euros, your basket first comes out at 20, you will then get your precious metal luxury cardstock for free. So this is where you're going to be getting a few sheets of your glitter card, you're going to get yourself a D's of glitter card, you're going to get some matte card and also a mirror card all contained inside this A4 pack. This isn't a tester pack, this is a full luxury card stock pack of precious metals that we sell day in, day out on our website, no problem whatsoever, but you're going to be getting it free as long as your basket and your order is over 20. So that is across on our website, so things like that as well as anything that we've been showing you all on crafterscompanion.co.uk.com.eu, that's where you need to go as well for Club Inspire, we'll tell you a little bit more about that later on in the show but we have actually what we're going to do and we've actually got a question about this one coming up Sarah C on YouTube is saying Craig do you have the samples of the small alphabet and dies please would be good to see the size I do I've got them right here so this is what we're going to be looking at our Gemini alphabet and number dies this is where you're going to get 110 so that's how it looks on the screen 17 pound or 25 dollars you're going to be saving over 20 percent but platinum price comes down to £13.60 or $20. When we come back to me just shortly, we'll have a look at these ones live so that uh, yourself, Sarah, can... Actually, let's have a wee look now. This is how these are. Now, your large ones are 0 0.8 <coughs> inches. 
So you've got your alphabet die and you've got your matte and layer die to go with it as well. So that's more your upper case. Then when it comes to your lower case, same 0 0.8, but you've got your lower case with your matte and layer die to go with it. And then these are all exactly the same. You've got your numbers and you've got your ordinals as well. All of these ones are 0 0.8. So, yes, you can go on that grand scale with the other ones we showed you on Wake Up Call with Debbie and we'll see just shortly. But these are nice for maybe your smaller cars and project. Best of both worlds. Talking about your larger alphabets, this is more like your mediocre ones. This is your left fold alphabet collection. 93 elements in total. £37.10, $49.48. Got really, really good saving again on that one. But platinum price comes down to $29.68 or $39.58 for all of that. You've got your uppercase. You've then got your numbers as well. But something I've not seen for quite a while, and I've not seen in quite a wee while within this bundle, is uh, some stamps to go with it as well. It's fab. Really, really fab one. And this is the set that I get asked quite a, uh, a lot when I'm doing cars or projects. Craig, where did you get that alphabet? It's from this set, but what I do is I die cut the alphabet and then I chop them out. So they're separate alphabets. That's up to you. But you've got that versatility. So we will have a look at them again just shortly. But that is definitely my highlight pick of the day when it comes to your left fold alphabets. Hi. How you doing, mate? I'm good, thank you very I much. I missed the centre and I was outside and I got well, lost. We, we were just wondering, we were just like, <laughs> uh, we were just talking, you get, you get lost. Yeah, there's yeah. too many areas around here, it's not what you're about. Yeah. Made a GPS tracking. To, to well, they, hey, there's an idea, there's yeah. an idea. So it's, it's too many people wanting a, a, a carrot pen, that's what it is. That's what it is. Um, so good to see you back. You were in earlier on on Wake Up Call. Yep. Many of you all have seen you before. Mm -hmm. um, we're now having a look, of course, at some new items that you've not brought to us before. Yep. You were on the UK's version of uh, Dragon's Den, of Sarah being one of the dragons, which is the UK version of Shark Tank. Tell us, uh, tell us a little bit about what did Sarah invest in? What about yourself and yeah. Wilson? Yeah. Well, um, so Dragon's Den was uh, very scary to start yeah. off with um, and so I invested in, it was great because you invest, kind of wanted to invest in us mm -hmm. before the company which is really nice um, and uh, all we did as soon as we pitched the, the product walked in I seen Sarah's massive smile and we knew we wanted Sarah before we walked right, in. Right, so you wanted Sarah. Oh yeah, it was, it perfect. was perfect um, and then uh, we, we, we had a lot of, I think at the start off we were trying to grill us on different items and then actually uh, um, Deborah was the first person to put a, mm -hmm. uh, an offer in. And then, and then Pete, Peter did, and then Sarah did at the end. Uh, and we were just so chuffed. And it was great. We did the deal with Sarah. Then the first time we ever spoke to Sarah, like one on one, was down out of the studios. She had a dressing gown and her slippers on. And it was like, oh, I'm so excited to work with you guys. I was like, hey, this is surreal. It's so <laughs> surreal. <laughs> but yeah, it's just incredible. We're so chuffed that she's got us on here as well to, to help us promote and also yeah. uh, and offer these amazing deals to, to her audience. Mm -hmm. and, uh, um, sorry, trusting me to, to do that is brilliant. Yeah, but what we're, we, we do have a big bundle. What we're, we're away to do, because you've also got a few new items that you've not seen before. Yeah, sure. We're away to have a look at one option that we've got, which is a five pack of plantable books yeah. um, that we've got here. And I've also got um, the fifth one to the side, and we will get it just in a second. But what is it? It's these ones here that we've got. What is it that you're actually, what, what is the will so? What is the plantable yeah. books? So the name comes from so uh, the Saturday mine will day and yeah. it was children will so so to, to get the books. But the original uh, products of, of the business were the carrot and lettuce. They were our first products, um, and as you can see there, there's lots of lumps and bumps in the pages, um, and they're all the seeds. Right. Okay. So it's really cool because the, the paper's all recycled paper, post-consumer waste. Um, and then uh, we have the story in the inner pages. Okay. So what's great is that you don't have to plant the book, the whole book. You can, the romances they can do, but they can just tear off the back page, right. read the story, keep reading the story whilst the carrots are growing. That is fab. That is really, it's really is fab. A carrot who's too big for his bed and his okay. fr friends of teamwork pulled together to pull him out of the ground. And then the children can then also be involved with the story by pulling their own carrots out of the ground from the actual story. Yeah, that is so good that you're able to do that. You know, we'll cover it just shortly, but you know what that does for uh, the kiddies at home oh, and my nephews that I was telling you about. Uh, is, so you've got the front, you've got the back. So this is a pack of five books, 44.95, um, or one of the key things as well. You guys stateside, 64. 
four ninety nine because you can only get them stateside from us. Yeah, Crafters that's TV. it. The only option to get them in America is there. So it, with the five book bundle, we have carrot, lettuce, and we have basil, dill, and parsley. It's a lovely group of books that um, that the stories are lovely and the activities are even better. It really, it's, it's fab to read. You know, I had a look at uh, the first few when uh, you were first on your Dragon's Den and I purchased them myself. The first thing I did was have a little read through them before I sent them to my, uh, as I say, my little nephews. But this one here is your five pack of all the books that you can see here. There is an option, we'll go over it just shortly. There's an option where we'll have a big bundle where you get four of them. Yep. So you might just want to hang fire just for a moment, just to make sure. What we wanted to do as well, because we knew as well it'd be considered purchase. Of course. Many of you thought, but purchased from you before when you were on, and no instantly you want it. Some might want to try one of the one of the things, few of the things that are new and um, that you have absolutely loved. So that was the books that we've just shown you there. Then what we're going to do is we're going to go over into the cards. So oh, these ones these are, are the greeting part. cards. <laughs> so there's kind of um, there's like two. It's one option, but then you've got two different kind of. Yeah, these What's are really the exciting. Word? Mix of cards. Yeah, and a different aspect to them as yeah. well. So our first card here is uh, our grass paper card. So literally when we were cutting a lawn, you can take the grass, um, what we're doing, taking the grass out of the lawnmower, making paper out of it. So this is 50% paper, 50% grass cuttings. That's brilliant. Um, and we've got some lovely messages of congratulations. We have, um, oh, sorry, the envelope thank you card here as well. And then we have, oh, um, there you go. And that's a happy birthday version. Right there. And so they're really nice designs, um, and also the envelope comes with them at the same time. Um, and then the, these are great. Uh, on the inner pages as well, they're blank, uh, so you can write your own message in there. They're about 350 GSM as well, so really nice. Really cards, good, really uh, sturdy. Good and you can still write with, you know, a, a normal pen that you would tend to write with. Well, I don't know or, if you call a carrot pen normal. Okay, I, it's, well, I it's uh, certainly yeah. a lovely carrot pen. It's funky. <laughs> Very few people that won't have. So you are getting the three cards that Tom just showed you. You are getting the pen as well, yep. and you're getting these four cards oh, as well yeah, with so the envelope. That's it. I like this how you that to me quickly because you knew what was inside. Uh, yeah, yeah, but yeah no, no, not at all, because <laughs> I'm, I, I'm absolutely, I won't do the lick test no, that you've done oh, yeah, earlier yeah, on. Yeah. Yeah, um, I but I yeah. now, so it's fine. <laughs> uh, no, no, I'm <laughs> I'd say so, kids love these. We both oh, find these hilarious. They're great, and they're made from elephant poo. So kids are obsessed with poo. What, what, yeah. That's it. Mm. And they were 20% elephant poo. All the nasties are taken out and like right. the, the hay that's left over. And the rest is recycled paper. And then we print them with vegetable-based inks as well. Okay. And make them all in the UK. They're just great. They've got a lovely message behind them. They're fun. Absolutely. They're interactive with children. It's another talk point with children when you buy them a gift. Um, and then there's some lovely designs here as well. So we have uh, happy birthday and the elephant has pooped in your card. I mean, and then we, we have love that. Uh, happy birthday. Uh, it's made, made of elephant poo. I get that straight for the camera. Sorry, I'm not used to the cameras. Oh, yet. you're doing yeah. awesome. There you you're go. doing awesome. Should have done my fingernails, get the mud out of them. Sorry <laughs> about that. Uh, and then have a poop birthday. And this is my all time favourite. And this is great for this time of year as well. It's the best Christmas car going. It is pooed off the red nosed reindeer. Mm -hmm. That is so good. So, some of these you may have seen when you were here the last time. The last time you were here, yep. there were some of these that I uh, that I purchased myself because I know who these are uh, going to be going to. That's for sure. So that was that set we showed you there. So you've got your kind of like your three cards there that are 50% uh, grass cuttings as well as additional recyclable material, and then you've got your four that are from Elephant Poop with the pen details on your screen. Maybe. You've still got to give your cards out. Maybe you've not got time to make them. Maybe you don't want to make them. You love the idea of the Poodolf. Then we do have an option where you get 10 of these. Yeah, 10. And the, it's, they're great. There's a great they're, platinum uh, price on these guys. That's it. So it actually works out that you are going to be getting one for free. It kind of works out you're paying for nine. You're getting one of them for free. So £27 or 39 dollars 15 but if you're platinum and that's key to point out you know it's tom it's will so but you still get your club inspire on top of that this is it yeah so if you're platinum it comes down to 2160 or 31 dollars 32 all of these with the envelopes that coordinate and you know for for crafters or even you know recipients now that, that's a big thing you don't want to have because it is a special card it's a unique card you don't want just a standalone 
white envelope. You no. still want it to complement, don't you? We've got and a craft, lovely there. craft card there. And as well, like Sarah's chucked in there as well, you've got the you've got the free gift given away. So if you spend over like 19 99 or 20, mm -hmm. 20, 20 pounds, yeah, you're getting a free gift as well with Wilso products. So it's win-win. Oh, you're learning good. Yeah. You're learning well. <laughs> um, so we did touch upon that we've got a few things that we've not seen before. Yep. One of these, these are absolutely phenomenal. These, these are, are, so good. are gift tags, isn't yeah. it? Now explain these, because these are world launch, I believe. That's it, yeah, first, first, so we have the Nutcracker gift tags. These are lovely because you can add these to any present, any, you could have them to a card if you wanted you to. But what you can do is, is once you finish your present, unwrap them, you can put this in the ground and it grows wildflowers. Brilliant. So it's lovely for the garden, lovely to support nature, for bees, for pollination. Um, and it's just in that, it's probably about, I don't know, 50 to 60 seeds just in that one. Just in that one? Yeah, not off for it. And you can see them if you turn them over on the back there as you well. You can, can't you? Um, and you can see all the seeds inside the card. And at the bottom there where it says Wilso, it says, plant me, I grow wildflowers as well. So you don't have to explain the image um, to the... The gift pack. That's a good oh, take on it, yeah. The person receiving yeah, the gift. Yeah, who's That's getting it, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Got there in the end, Luke. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't get there. You get um, there, no. So we have three different sizes. We have the larger one with the nutcrackers. Yeah, and you're getting everything we are showing you. So you're getting your 10 of your large, you're getting 10 of your medium, and 10 of the small. So That's these it. ones are the medium ones, aren't they? Yeah, and then we have five different designs. Um, and we, thank you, I'll Craig. take them. Uh, five different designs. There's two of each design. Oh, there we go. Uh, I'm all spreading them all out. So we have a lovely uh, Santa Claus one there. Uh, we have a little uh, Mrs. Claus. Yeah. Uh, we have a ra nice reindeer there. Again, all the back, that's blank, and they have the uh, I'm Plant Me, I'll Grow Wildflowers. Uh, we have a lovely snowman. Um, my final one, my best one's an elf. No, little not elf. a little elf that's helping everyone out is the final one. And I think really is important, as you say, on the back of them, you've got that printed, so you don't have to inform them. Sometimes maybe someone will be like, Plant me, uh, I grow. They're going to type in your name. They're going to yeah. see exactly what they're about. But we're still not finished there because you've got 10 in those. And then you've also got 10, which can I just say as well, you've even included the twine as well. Yeah. The green twine for all of these. Last nice Christmas vision, which is a lovely number of touch points. So you've got a lovely present that you're giving them, a lovely wrapping paper. And then it, you're even thinking about a real thoughtful aspect is that you can plant the gift tag. So you've got so many areas where you're going to, mm -hmm. not one present, you've got three presents. Yeah. And as crafters, you might use them as little tuck ins and a little envelope scrapbook pages yep. anything along those lines once again you do get 10 of these as well and you get a variety of different kind of christmas flower or foliage designs as well so it's your you're all you're getting your large your medium and your small 10 in each that's 30 in total for 23.99 or 32 dollars 49 Still with your Club Inspire, $19.99 or $25.99. As Tom was saying, on that today's price, $23.99, you're over that £20 mark. So then yeah. that means that you're going to get that 40 sheet cardstock completely free. Right, cardstock, uh, the, the, so the free gift, uh, again, even the set's collapsing. Say, Johnny, what have you just said Sorry, there? Sorry, I, I mastered it. It was my fault. I put some stockings in the back there. <laughs> oh, that's fine. No, Johnny was just actually saying it has been so busy so far today. That free gift is while stocks last, and we don't think we're going to have enough, maybe to potentially it last within this show. Definitely not later on. So if you have been humming in high at hand and you're thinking, I want that free gift, yep. I really want to do it, you know, I'd urge you go across onto the website, see what you want, shop the day, check it out. You don't need to do anything. The guys and girls in the warehouse will pop that straight into your, uh, well, can you, your parcel, and it'll get shipped to you. No problem whatsoever. Yeah, sounds great. So that's the tags. We've still and we've still got new tags. We've still got more. Still got so we've more. got wildflower paper. This is really cool. This is a, this is a crafters first as well. So last time we were on the show, um, I really wanted to listen to what the, the, the audience was saying. Yeah. And uh, they mentioned if they would have any wildflower paper. So I thought, why not? Let's bring it to this show for a first. So we've got some oversized A4 sheets, um, and this is about 220. Um, uh, millimeters by 320 millimeters uh, and they are lovely so you've got 10 sheets per pack and uh, they're about 300 gsm so nice and thick uh, it's all recycled paper at the same time um, and what you can create with this is is endless you could do belly bands for for gifts you could yeah. do envelopes out of this you can make your own cards 
because it's oversize A4, you could draw your image uh, or, or um, uh, with the watercolour pens from mm -hmm. you guys. Because you were saying earlier that you could do it, you know, you don't want to oversaturate with your watercolours, but you can do a little yeah. bit of watercolour in. You probably want to do about 20% coverage on okay. this page. Um, and then, well, you can crease it, you can um, make a box out of anything you want. Yeah. It's, it's a nice thickness, so it's it's very, uh, you can mould it into anything, really. Yeah. So, you know, if, you, if you've gone for the books, you know, you could make a box, box lid and base, which would fit the books. And then not only have you got the plantable books, yeah. you've then got the plantable box as well, maybe with the tag on it as well, which actually is, we've got a couple of, couple of questions that have just caught, come through. Yeah. Helen Moore on YouTube had said, what age is recommended for the books? Yeah, so this is a really good question. Yeah, so it it's, is. A, it's a multiple answer, really. So our age range, we say from three, because seeds are small parts. So yeah. if you start eating the book, we have to be careful. But we, we almost two, really, if you're doing it together, and, That's uh, it. and it works perfect. And we say to about, the reading age is three to eight, and then the activity is three to 10, because bigger kids like it. Um, but the, the actual stories, so I would say carrot and lettuce are maybe towards a slightly younger age, um, and then the herb heroes are like a, towards the larger age. Uh, but all books appeal to everyone because mm -hmm. The story and the activity That's reaches it. all children, so um, it's a very hard to put a specific age on it. So yeah, yeah between three and ten. That's it. It's, it's just yeah. you know as they're starting to grow and they're soaking up all that information, it, you yeah. know, that you can uh, at those age with the supervision, even at the even younger. As we were saying, I've said it a few times, um, and of course I'll say it again. Just after you were on Dragon's Den, because yeah. uh, I've watched it from the very start, not just because Sarah had come on. Very next day, I went online, sourced your books, bought some for my little nephews. And I got uh, Munro now, at the time it was only Grayson, so I sent them to his mum and dad, Ian and Jess, and uh, just the last time Tom was in, Jess had sent me these pictures of Grayson, who had been planting them, and this is um, uh, after he's planted them, so Ian and Jess, they were giving them a helping hand, They're great. but by helping them being out there, it was kind of like early springtime, yeah. he was having fun, and then months down the line, he grew this. And what's so good about this is it was able to explain to them that once they cooked it, it was, they said it was lovely, it was delicious, still do what you do with carrots. But it's a good way to show them that things aren't perfect. Yeah. They're and not perfect. It's great. And from that image there, you just see Grayson, he's holding a huge carrot mm -hmm. that's non-GMO, so they grow all different shapes and sizes. So it's yeah. really nice to teach children the same thing. Yeah, so it's, it's really good. It also taught them, like, patience. You know, you can't just have it there and then. Yep. You have to wait, you have to nurture it. Such a lovely idea and that's why I'm such a, a big fan advocate oh, of great. Um, you, the whole products that you do at Will, so that is for sure. Yeah. Now, tell you what, well, what do we do? We've got our lovely soil here. Yeah. Um, what, exactly, what would we do? We've got our uh, page. We've taken it off the front or the back. What would, what would do we, what do, we do? So, oh, sorry, I just dropped some soil in the studio there. Sorry, John. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'll get told off there. <laughs> and so um, we've got the story. We're obviously, you've got to read the story with the children. Um, and it's really simple because all the on the back page, once we've finished the story, um, is the all the instructions are in the in the back page right um so it's up to them they can either uh, cut along the dotted lines what the instruction tells them or they can cut a lot a strip or a corner uh, and then plant that you could share it between siblings as well you don't have to have like one book each That's which is a really good nice idea. Um, so what i'm going to do is then just going to cut along the uh the dotted lines okay. here and because you've done them the front and back, it doesn't uh, break up the story. Yeah. It's not as if that you're not going to find the end of the story That's or a really the good beginning. Point. A really good point. You know, yeah. And you can keep reading the story. So you, cliffhanger, you can keep reading that. cliffhanger at the end. What, what, what happens? That's it. You got it. So you just all you're going to do here um, is just to move a, a slight bit of soil. You look at about 10 millimetres of soil. Uh, stick that on top. Uh, and then all you're going to do is water every day. Unfortunately, health and we safety, can, yeah. you can't bring water in. Um, but hang on a second, here's what I made earlier. And then, boom, uh, your Perfect. carrot pops out. <laughs> um, but, yeah, as you can see, you don't need a lot of um, you don't, soil you in really there. Don't. Loose soil. Um, if you mix a bit with sand in there as well, um, it helps the carrots be a bit looser to grow okay. deeper. But what's really nice is as well, you don't have, as you can see here, we've got a nice big crate in here. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, all the space, you don't need all this space whatsoever. No. You could do in a nice little um, takeaway tub um, that you could put onto your windowsill. So even small. Yeah, and yeah. you could put it into a plant pot, so you don't have to have a garden to grow them. So it's really nice. You're not you're not just limiting it to anyone. Um, yeah. If you live in a flat, that'd be perfect to look. Perfect. On the on the balcony, yeah. Knowing that you're able to do sill. that, you know, obviously we do it so it's easier to show you. But it doesn't have to be. If you've got an allotment or that, brilliant, great. The grandparents are doing brilliant. But if not, just in a small space. Got one question. This was asked earlier on, but it's come through again. So we're going to ask Clarice on YouTube has said, how long will the seed books 
be kept. How yeah. long will they last? That's lovely. So the story you can keep forever if you yeah. don't want to plant the book. But the seeds last from two to three years, uh, and then the germination reduces after that. So maybe in four years' time, maybe 30% of the seeds will grow. But what's really nice is, is that you can then uh, plant reed now and then plant in probably May okay. when, when the freeze, the frost is gone. Yeah. And then uh, if the year after that, they could probably plant the cover. Um, if they're more hungry, if right. there's more lettuce or carrots, they can do that. That's brilliant. You're able to just stagger them out if you wanted to. That's so, so good. Righty-o. What about if you're like, Craig, I love it all, I want it all, well, we've got you covered as well. So if you want to go for our big collection, this is our 17-piece collection, it is going to be £104.47 or $147.49. You've still got a really, really good saving when it comes to that today's price. However, if you are platinum, oh, that's going to come down. It is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. For all of that, platinum price, you're going to be £83.58 or $117.99. Now, you are going to get what myself and Tom showed you, but there was that much. I had to write it down because, in total, <laughs> you're going to get four books. You're then going to get three cards, which are the ones that are 50% grass cutting, That's right, 50% yep. recycled material. You're getting four cards, which is made from the elephant poo. You're then getting 30 tags in total, 10 large, 10 medium, 10 small. You're also getting your 10 sheets of that wildflower paper, although it's a substantial card, yep. and you're going to get your carrot pen as well. All of that platinum price, 83 58 or $117.99. Plus for all the that. free gift because it's over £20. Exactly. So That as well. Yeah. Win-win, isn't it? Win-win for all of that. Uh, thank you so, so much, no Tom. Worries, We're going to see you again uh, shortly, I believe, yeah. in a bit, maybe in about 40 minutes or so. So if you do have any questions, file them across to Rachel. She'll uh, give us a helping hand and we can ask them for uh, to Tom. Uh, what we are going to do is we are going to give you a little bit of a break. Just to say there's still a few gremlins in the system. Keep checking at the website. We'll let you know as well. Just persevere. But there is some uh, incredible deals you're already taking advantage of. We are going to give you a moment to check out. And then uh, when we come back, we're going to jump back to Debbie and, of course, our numbers and uh, Alphabet Masterclass. Welcome to Crafters TV. With more than 35 hours of live shows each week, it's your home for all things craft. So, join our family of craft experts with live tutorials and demonstrations every day. We shine the spotlight on new and innovative crafting products here on Crafters TV. Get creative and craft along with our amazing deals. Your next craft project is only a click away. Tune in live seven days a week or watch on Catch Up at crafterscompanion.com, Facebook or our YouTube channel. You can chat to us, craft along and meet new friends in our online crafting community. You entertain us, you give us a community to talk, you know, in the chat. That wouldn't happen without you guys. It's like um, Crafters Companion is magical. There's magic here. You all have time with each other! <laughs> You're not through to boot camp. Get off! <laughs> <laughs> There's a show for every type of crafter, from first-time dabblers to full-time makers. So, stop what you're doing and enjoy the fun here on Crafters TV. Many of our viewers bring up time and time again, and that's our wax seal seal gate. Thinking, though, it might not work as well because I've put too much... <laughs> Oh, I've forgotten to put me, um, <laughs> me thing in place. <laughs> <laughs> because I have a way of words, but I think that doesn't engage with that and can come out all wrong. Water. That, that wasn't the one you kit. just washed your brush in, was it? Sorry. Yes, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> no, it wasn't, was it? It was. Are you kidding? I'm going to have to say, it's a slip of the tongue. I'm going to say it's maybe to do with my Scottish accent. I'm maybe going to say it's because of Mr. Uh, ben Mosby. He is, well, yeah, he doesn't help matters. Um, I've made pots that have exploded when I fired them. I've done zips in inside out. It happens to everybody. We've all spilt our glitter all over our project or knocked the water over. 
Do I? I've just noticed I've got my dress on inside out. <laughs> <laughs> so I was messing about doing some backgrounds with the sparkling, took the lid off it and managed to catch the pot somehow and the whole thing came towards me, down my front, across my lap, onto the floor. I went to reach for the water and, you know, do the, the, the tapping with the, the, and so there was less tapping and more sort of a tsunami. Um, <laughs> I've got some... <gasps> A um, lot and lot of lovely comments for uh, Tom there and everything that he was showing you. We've uh, actually, Rachel, our Rachel has said, uh, she's actually saying, Hi Tom, I see that you're from my neck of the woods. I'm Lester Bourne. There you go. He's, he's just away to exit the studio, so I just thought I would fire that across to you. We've also got Geoffrey Langley saying, Good day to Craig, Debbie, Rachel and guest Tom and all the great superstars, CCTV and folk that are in here today. Alicia Gordon is saying good morning, greetings from Arkansas, working while listening to my favourite channel. You were doing the same this morning, weren't you? I remember. We've, uh, we've shown you those little dies as well. Clardon is saying I ordered the Poodolf and the birthday card from Will, so the last time he was on and they are such a hit. I'm going to order the largest bundle uh, when it is available this time. Yeah, just please, uh, you know, do apologise. The Gremlins just in the system with uh, the, uh, the bundle. That's for sure. Keep having a look, but we'll let you know when it's up and live. Helen Moore is saying, I have the pop-out numbers and I love those cards, number dies. They never go out of style. A couple more for now. We've also got Charlotte saying, me too. I love the spring bloom paper pad. So it's going to the paper Debbie was showing earlier on. We've also got, Helen is also saying, you can maybe make cake toppers with them depending on the cake size. So it's going with the, um, I think it was, I think maybe the left fold alphabet, yeah. maybe. Don't see why not, you could do. Uh, and I did think this while Debbie was hunting, but I've been off since last week, so I'm in the clear. Hmm. <laughs> Craig, is there any, Craig, <coughs> is there, and the foam pads are missing. So I think it, Craig is there and the foam pads are missing. Oh. Not guilty on this one. <laughs> not guilty, because I've not been here on this one. Uh, right, just quickly before we move on, while myself and Tom were talking, Debbie's been having a little play with that wildflower paper. I did, because while you were busy talking, I thought, oh, I remember that Sarah asked me to make an envelope, so I did. I made a little 6x4 envelope, uh, because you'd, you only, for a 6x4 envelope, you only need a 7.5 inch square piece, um, and you follow the on the envelope, mm -hmm. it's the D and the H. Uh, signs. I mean, I can show you later, but I just wanted yeah. to show you. Um, makes a beautiful, beautiful envelope. Uh, really, and, and I was saying to Tom, which I still can't get my head round, I said, you did to Craig. You did, yeah. I'm like, so what do you do then? Once you've sent it to someone, and obviously you're going to tell them to throw it away, but not throw it away, because you want to tell them to throw it in soil. Yeah. You just pop it in the soil, and wildfire, wildflower mm -hmm. will grow. Yeah. Uh, honestly, I'm wowed by that. Yeah. I am literally wowed by all well, that. Absolutely amazing that you pop an envelope, or you can't when you're finished, pop your envelope in the car into the soil, and wild flower will appear. Do you know what Johnny's just, just said? Crazy. Right, enough, eh? Circle of life. It's Isn't true. That it's yeah. absolutely true, but yes, yeah, so you can. So it does score quite. I mean, I, 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 obviously, you have to be a bit careful when you're scoring. Yeah. Uh, just be a bit more gentle right, okay. because, um, and I'm saying gentle, this is really tough. This is not flimsy. Yeah. Um, but what I just wanted to get across is, is in the terms of the seed embedded in there. So there's the seeds inside. Okay. So just take your time with that. But I'll, if, I'll by all means show you how to pop a little six by four envelope together uh, later on. But I just wanted to show you, yes, Sarah, I don't know why she thinks of these things, but mm -hmm. Clearly, clever. Clearly, she's a clever lady. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, so that works absolutely fine as well. Brilliant. Brilliant. Uh, right, to let let us know throughout the show and later on what you're going to be doing with your cardstock when you get it. What you're going to do with the tags? Are you going to gift them to certain people with a little message on there? You're going to make something. You're going to incorporate them with scrapbook pages. Let Rachel know in the social, and we'll have a read through again just very very shortly.
Right, let's have a look when it comes to what we are looking at now. This one here is our multi-craft alphabet number and punctuation dies. This is where it is three packs, but in total you're getting 73 dies. I'm going to say what Johnny just said in my ear. It's very busy for this. It is £69 or $81. Platinum price £55.20 or $64.80. And remember, while stocks last and we're getting very, very limited, you will get your free pack of your luxury pe precious metal card stock. I am going to reiterate that again. We are so, so low on the quantities of these. It is while stocks last. So at the moment, we've still got some, so keep that one in mind. Debbie, these are multi-craft alphabet yes. dies. So what exactly does that mean when it comes to multi-craft? So multi-craft die is a bit like a mixed media, multimedia die okay. in terms of it will cut through um, more deeper um, fabrics, um, layers of cardstock. Multi-craft means it, multi it, it goes across both crafts. So it's paper craft as well as sewing. Got so you. it's perfect for all your applique dies. You'll probably see Becky use these um, over the t over the course of time that she does uh, soft side of life with us here. Um, but they are to be used as well in paper craft, which is why I have a set and I know Craig's got a set mm -hmm. and all the other team, they've got theirs. I love these because they've got the lowercase, the uppercase and all the numbers. And not just that, but you've got on the numbers, and if I just show you just for a second so you can see, you've even got all your ampersand on there, your hashtag, your exclamation mark, uh, your question mark, your apostrophe. Um, so there's loads on there as well as those numbers. But these are big dies. They're not little dies, they're big dies. And Huge. it does mean that you can cut through those multiple layers of, uh, like I said, in our, t in our case, because we're looking at these as paper crafting, um, you would use cardstock. You could use a chipboard, you could use things like yeah, you um, could, you? acetate, glitter card stock, um, loads and loads of different things that you can use. And then, of course, the multi-craft side of it means that you can cut other things yeah. like your materials as well. So that's your uppercase one as well, a really big size. And the fact that you're not having to choose, Craig, is what I love. Exactly. Because you could start off with a large D and then move to your E and your B. And, you know, like mm -hmm. if you were doing it... As you would be writing. That's it, Capital, as you're writing, And the yeah. smaller ones, if that's what you want yeah. to do. So for me, I absolutely love these. I'm going to keep it really simple, though, for mine. I'm going to make a little, little tiny abacus oh, in yeah. the form of my little... Now, you know I love a cube card. You do? That I adore do. them. And I've said this before. Large, small, big, fat, thin. I love them, but I've gone diddy. Little small. dinky diddy one. A little baby dinky diddy, diddy one for a little... It'll be for a little... You know, nursery or, so, yeah, or something, nursery or maybe a baby, baby, but it's just being born in your family. Keep, yeah. uh, but again, just keeping it really nice and simple. And I am going to cut out multiples of that as well. So I'm going to use some cardstock. Now I've gone for um, a textured cardstock with this one. So I've gone with a, and I've gone, I've kept it quite. I'm going to say boyish. Mm -hmm. I will call it boyish because yep. they're kind of masculine colours. kind of colours, aren't they? Um, <coughs> Excuse me. So these are from our Neutrals uh, textured cardstock pad. Um, and I've gone with that lovely mustardy colour um, offset against that grey. But I'm going to cut out multiples. Like I said, I'm not just going to cut one layer out. So I'm going to layer on my A, B and C. OK. I'm thinking, if I don't say A, B, C, <laughs> let's get it that way around. Uh, and I'm going to do it in a couple of pieces as well. So let's um, cut this down to size a little bit. And that's the good thing with these ones being the multi-craft. If you are just using them for your cardstock, you can do multiple layers at <coughs> once with absolute ease. Absolutely. So let's go in and I'm going to cut another strip down as well. There's lots of giggling going off in our ear today, isn't there? Uh, honestly, well... <laughs> <laughs> what shall we say about that, Craig? So yes. Charlotte's sharing information in our ear that uh, she's going to have to share with us later, isn't she? Yeah. Off air. We'll just go off air. She's laughing at her own jokes. I mean, well... Yeah, so it's some, something reminds her of a joke and it set herself off. Oh, my little giraffe sparked a joke. Well, well, honestly... Watch we're not, space. And we're not letting him move on. No. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny, Did you know what's going to happen? The comments are just going to be, oh, I want to know what that joke was. <laughs> no. no. Right, so let's go in and I'm going to pop on uh, me one, two and me three. And again, I'm going to just layer those down. So, um, low tack tape. Let's go back in for that one. 
Uh, just no. imagine with these, as you were saying, you know, I know Becky's got a set, you know, if you're doing, you know, and please forgive me, if you're doing whatever you'd be doing with your materials and that, you know that I'm not a soft crafter, I don't know much of the terms or that, but if you cut these out in your materials, your fabrics, stitch them on, maybe you do a little bit of bunting, maybe a quilt with their name or their date, that they were born or whatever it is, you can then start to incorporate these because they're big, they're chunky, but the perfection that it cuts within the materials will be off the scale. Absolutely. Oh, look at this. They just, I mean, I could have got three, do you know you what? Could I could have, have got about three or four sheets out of that, to be fair. Um, but that's fine. And I've just realised my own little faux pas, um, I'd put it in with the, um, and I always tell you with multimedia dies, you don't necessarily need to mm -hmm. use that. Um, so we'll go without it uh, for this next bit. Um, and then just go straight back in <laughs> and run those through as well. I think that's yeah. the thing as well, isn't it? With our normal dies, we, we tell you the plate configuration, but sometimes you don't actually even need that full configuration, do you? Exactly, yeah. You, it's, I always say, whenever you're using your machine, um, you need to just think about your die, yeah. the, the, the material that you're using, um, because they're shims, they're there for a reason, mm -hmm. aren't they? Mm -hmm. So, but again, just look at this. They've cut through those perfectly, and I've got loads now, so I could be making multiples of these, especially if you're batch making, or if you're personalising again. Yeah. This is going to be the alpha bet set maybe that for you um, in terms of and I probably would say this in terms of um, multi cutting yeah this would be the set to go for yeah because you could cut through all your words in one pass and you could two and three so maybe three or four vowels mm -hmm. at a time so so you'd be able to get quite a lot out from one pass of your machine. So for me, I think that's where I would be going. Yeah. Um, you always tell as well with um, a multi-craft die that it's a different colour. Yeah. So a multimedia die and a, a multi-craft die are different colours. And this has got that coppery gold look to it. It does, doesn't um, it? Which differentiates it between the two. So again, really nice and straightforward, cut through there. I mean, to be fair, this we're talking about this masterclass but it's, it's, it's self-explanatory, mm -hmm. to be fair. It's just giving you some different ideas and different choices as well, yeah. different choices of alphabets that you want to use. Now, the only thing that I've done different with uh, mine is I've taken, and I've been looking everywhere, Craig, and I don't know, I had an art liner in my bag, but it seems to have, um, I say vanished, it's probably fallen out. There, there was one, wasn't there? I did have one in my craft yeah. bag, but I don't know where it's gone. Let me see if I can find it. Because I could really do with a little art liner, because I've just created a little bit of faux stitching round yeah. the edge. Um, so I'll, I'll bring it in and show you what I mean. So I'm just thinking that I've lost my other ones. They're stuck underneath. Oh, they're all, they're all together. Yeah, they're stuck underneath. I haven't lost them at all. I'm thinking, where's my other multi-cuts gone? Yeah, but yeah, I could have easily got a lot more out of there. You could have, couldn't yeah, you? Yeah, e easy peasy. So there you go, I've got loads already made just from that one pass of the machine with those. But yeah, I did a bit of faux stitching round uh, the outside. So if I just move those out of the way... I'm just singing myself you there. Mean. Yeah. I've just seen it. One, two, three. Easy as A, B, C, just the way it was laid out. So I've just taken my art liner and gone all the way around just with a little bit of faux stitching. Um, and talking about faux stitching, there's some... Um, Something new coming up on Friday. Shall we just leave it there? Ooh. Got some, got some new, uh, a new launch on Friday that might involve a bit of stitching. Really? Mm-hmm. Charlotte, does that Charlotte not know? Maybe she doesn't. She, I know, because she, she sounded genuinely. What is it? What is it? It's the new embroidery dies. Did you not know? Even Johnny doesn't know. Look at Johnny. So it's Friday. Did you not know, Johnny? Oh, oh, have we? Oh, oh, am I with you, Johnny? Have I really talked to you about this already? Oh, dear Lord. <laughs> I'm going to send my brain fog. It's getting worse. What was that, Johnny? Oh, yes. I think I might be with Debbie, actually. I think you are, yeah. Oh, my goodness me, I'm spot rotten. Two Debbies. Two, Two Debbies, Debbies and a Lily. <laughs> So can you imagine me with I'm <laughs> sorry, what's happened to Craig? But <laughs> excuse me. I can, oh, I can't wait. I cannot wait to see Debs. I've not seen her for absolutely ages. <laughs> hey, 
Oh dear. Craig, something's tickled him. Uh, you're going to have to excuse him, Charlotte. Oh. He's, uh, he's, he's gone. Um, he's gone. Yeah, so oh. let's, let's just show you. I'm just doing a little bit of drop shadowing again. <laughs> A little bit of a drop shadow. When I say a little bit, I'm just literally lowering it slightly. And that's just to create a little bit of a, a depth to me, to me out the beds. So again, I've just done the same. I'll push all those over there. I did those with my numbers as well. So I've got my one, my two, and my three, and the four, four stitching, and then the ABC. And then we're going to put this card together. Now, this card is really easy to do. I've talked about these styles of cue cards so many times because it's just one of my favourite makes. Um, this actually measures at all eight and a half inch by four and I've scored it at two four six and eight and it creates that main cube like so that goes around so that one is eight and a half by um, four, four inches scored at two scored at four scored at six scored at eight and then for the two smaller panels this one this one is a uh, eight and a half by two and again scored at the same place two four six and eight and all i'm going to do is i'm just going to pop me glue onto the tab and fold that around and it literally forms the cube like so so easy really really easy to achieve this kind of look are you all right now craig yep absolutely fine that's good that's good so i'm just going to go pop that back on there and that's my second cube done and then on that last one as well, just on that inside tab, folding it in on itself. And there you go, you've got your cubes made nice and easy. So again, what I'm just going to do now is attach the cubes. So okay. as I always do, I literally pop it at the bottom, but I need to flatten it first. So I'm just going to pop on this bottom panel a bit of glue. When you first had shown that finished sample, many might think, oh my gosh, that's a, that's a really big concept to make. You're folding, you're scoring, you're attaching, whereas you've, you've done them singly yeah. and then attaching them. So, it's, honestly, it's super, super easy to do and it's a really effective card. I've done it quite a few times now and I know um, a lot of people... They still lo love that style. I adore it, and I adore doing, like I said, I've done big, massive ones as well as little ones too, Craig. So this, this is a really nice uh, style card to achieve. And it's a lot easier than it looks. It, so it if I really just is. push that out now, you can see it forms my cube. And all you do is you're just forcing it back into its place uh, and just giving it some rigidity. So again, because I've used a textured cardstock, I didn't want it to be... I suppose you could. I mean, I usually use uh, multi-purpose cardstock. Perfect. It's what I use because it's got three... It's a 300 GSM. A textured cardstock is not as heavy a weight. OK. Uh, but, just give that a little... And all I'm going to do now is... <laughs> right, I'm going to pop on my panels, so <laughs> I'm going to put some panels just onto the inside of my cube. <coughs> is it me or has it got really warm in here? Very. Oof, it's gone really, really hot, hasn't it? So again, I'm just going to <laughs> push like so onto there. In fact, do you know what I might use? I might use my uh, tape pen. Let's, get, let's go in and just... And literally, because you're thinking of these as two by two now, uh -huh. you know that your mats and layers, if you're anything like me, Craig, and I know you are because we're two kindred spirits we there, are. we go about a quarter of an inch in. So when you think about it, it's one and three quarter inch square and then one and a half inch square, and mm -hmm. that's your mats and layers covered. Really nice and easy, really nice and simple. And I'm just basically wanting to cover the cube part and then my, my alphabet and my numbers can sit on either side. Really so again, simple to create. I mean, it really cut. It really is a very effective. It's an effective fold. It is. Um, mm -hmm. And then it can be dressed up with any of the alphabets. And to be fair, any of the alphabets that we're using today could you could be doing this style of card. That's with. true. Yeah, you're right. Actually, aren't you? Yeah. You could do. So again, I'm just going to pop that onto there, and then lastly, there we go. Onto that last one. Love how this is coming coming together. 
There we go. So I'm just going to flatten that a minute just for a second. Okay. I just want to make sure all those pieces are stuck down. And then we're going to decorate it. So I'm going to pop on, um, and I think I will use, I'm going to use me, me uh, glue again, me chunky glue. So I'm just going to pop some glue just onto the back. I'm going to have to ask John and Jake where the uh, foam pads have gone. Because mm -hmm. they've disappeared. And I'm just going to have them, um, what did we call it earlier? Jointy? Uh, jointy. Jointy angle. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. So again, just bits of glue, just attached all the way you know around what that. What you could do, Debbie, yeah. with your alphabets and even your numbers, yeah. even if you just pop them on with a little glue dot, you could die cut them in your wildflower cardstock. Ooh. And then just oh, like like that, just a little glue dot, maybe a medium foam pad or something, so they could prise it off. Oh. Or maybe a certain alphabet or, or letter or number. Yeah, I like that idea. Yeah, you could, couldn't you? Yeah, definitely. You're full of these ideas today, Craig. That's what we'll so bring. I know, with absolutely. What we've got. I mean, I've just, I, I were really looking forward to today. I were do dubious whether or not I could be able to get here, but uh, I'm so glad I've been able to because honestly, he's, he's just blown my mind. Mm -hmm. I love, love, love his products. They're absolutely incredible. He's such a nice guy. He's, he is lovely. Really, he's a lovely, really nice lovely man. Guy. He is. So there's the basis of my little abacus all sorted. But it's just missing something. Okay. So got my little giraffe. Oh, and you oh. recognise the little giraffe, don't you? I do indeed. Yeah, so uh, my papers are from the baby. Do you know the baby pad that we have? The... Um, the um, uh, Violet, Violet Studio. Thank you, yes. Oh, the baby yes. one, yeah. Yeah, that's that one. So, again, I'm just going to pop on and he's going to sit in that little corner. So, I'm just going to turn it this way and pop him and just, he can sit there in that centre. Like How so. cute is that? What like a it. lovely way, Debbie, to be using your alphabet and a lovely way to use your multi-craft by doing several layers at once. Yes, yep, yeah, absolutely. Brilliant. Love that one. Like Rhonda was saying, you can make this style of card just about any size you want to make it. You can do, absolutely. Uh, so that was your multi-craft alphabet number and punctuation dies. So it's three packs, however, in total, you are going to be 73 dies. So today's price, £69 or $81. So you've got a really good saving, really good savings right across the board today on the today's prices, saving £50.97 or $53.85. But you've guessed it. If you are platinum, it comes down to £55.20 or $64.80. And we still have a little bit left. That means that you will get your free gift because you're spending over £20, $20 or €20, Euros, which means you'll get your full pack, 40 sheets, luxury card of precious metal. So just to warn you yet again, that even kind of like every five minutes, if not every few minutes, the numbers are dwindling. So keep that in mind if you want to get your free gift because it is well stocks last. So really good one. Going to work really well, what Debbie was showing you. Then you might want to pop some Centura Pearl in. You've maybe never tried it before and you want to hear and see what all the fuss is about. Maybe you just need to stock up. 100 sheets of your Centura Pearl. So this is a lovely selection. All of this, 310 GSM. You're going to be £30 or $40. Saving 15% over a card stock that we never have to discount because we sell it day in and day out at full price. But that's not what we're about. And it does mean at platinum price, you're going to come down to £24 or $32. And while stocks last, you are going to get your free gift as well. Then we've got Debbie Fisher's favourite ink pads. This is a Harmony Opaque Pigment. This is 10 ink pad collection. This is going to give you a shiny enamelled like finish. Just want to pop some embossing powders over, although you don't have to. Today's price being £50 or $76. Platinum price comes down to £40 or $60.80. And once again, while stocks last, you're going to get your free gift on top of that one. 12 days of Christmas. Craftmas. Then maybe you love to do your shakers. Maybe you want to then just pop little sequined embellishments throughout your card and project. This is working out that you buy three, you're getting one for free. This is your mixed sequence collection. Each bag weighs 50 grams, £8.97 or $11.85 for all of that. And these are our 
are four relatively new colours, only launched over the last few months or so. Good saving of 25%. However, platinum price comes down to $7.18 or $9.48. What's also been really, really popular, and we've not really focused on it, just Debbie's been using it throughout Wake Up Call and Masterclass. This is Leanne's favourite glue in the whole entire world. This is your Collal all-purpose glue. This is your three-pack collection. £10 or $20, saving again over 15%. This is another one we do not have to discount. We sell day in and day out, but we still give you the best deals we can. Platinum price for all three, £8. £8 for three tubs, tubes of your call out all purpose glue, £8. However, if you are platinum in the US of A, you're going to be $16. All of that, everything else that you've been uh, hearing us talking about or what Debbie's been demonstrating, Tom and Will, so across on our website, have a look, crafterscompanion.co.uk.com.eu. And then we're away to, in a moment, once we've done the comments, we'll have a look at another half price deal, which we're crazy busy within Wake Up Call. I don't know if we're going to have any. Are we due to be showing it in Monday Makers? If there was any left, there might be, but... I, I think we, we might not be. Uh, right here, we have got um, Carletta saying, I would, I would love getting an envelope like that mailed to me. That was one Debbie made with the wildflower papers. How lovely would that be, getting that? And first you just think it's lovely recycled paper, and then you realise it's actually print, uh, printable. It is plantable paper. We've then got Sarah C. Could you please show the size between these dies and the left fold dies? We'll do that just in a moment because we're going to have a look at the left fold dies. So we'll compare these dies to the ones Debbie was just showing a moment ago. We've also got uh, Carletta's also saying, what is the height and the width of the alphabet? So while we are having a look at the left fold, we'll also have a look at the uh, multimedia ones and we will size them for you. Rhonda's saying, you can make the style of card just about any size you want to make it. The one that Debbie done, you can do. Rhonda is also saying, the Centura Peril is amazing. Let's put paper, um, and it is amazing, but the card sock bundle that we've got uh, Helen Moore is saying it is, it is mentioned the cardstock gift is adhesive. If so, is it just those or are the others also adhesive? So it's myself that mentioned that. What you've got is 10 in the free gift, 10 sheets of them. So 10 sheets of the shedless glitter has an adhesive back in. So not all of them, it's only 10 sheets. That is your shedless glitter that has an adhesive back in. It tells you on that one down at the bottom. So hopefully that helps. And then last but by no means least, Rhonda is saying, I'm with Leanne, my all-time favourite glue is the Collal all-purpose glue. And actually I know you use it quite a lot as well, Debbie, don't you? The all-purpose glue at times. So uh, head across to the website with that incredible deal of your three tubes of your all-purpose glue. Right, let's have a look at our left fold alphabet. So this is what we'll be looking at now. And this has the actual alphabet numbers, I've seen pop into shows every now and again, but I've not seen what was the original launch with your embellishment stamp and dies to go with them. That full collection that we had at the first launch, we have managed to get it back as the full collection, but at the most ridiculous, crazy price, good for you at home, that comes for the full set. So this is a half price deal. So you're going to be getting your full alphabet. And these are called your left fold alphabets because once you run them through, they cut all around the right hand side, top and bottom, but they stay in place in the left fold with a little score line. So you've then got your left fold. So we'll have a look at these in Wake Up Call with Debbie. We're going to have a look again in a wee moment. But you've got your full alphabet and then you've got your numbers and your and as well. All of them exactly the same left fold alphabet. But then what you're getting with this half price deal is your left fold alphabet stamp and die embellishments, basically. Both of these 
you're going to be getting. These are worth £15 each. Now, you've got your stamps and you've also got your sentiments. You've got a banner die for your sentiments and you've got a die for all your embellishments as well. The flowers, butterflies, hearts. And then on the additional one, you've got some cupcakes, you've got some stars, you've got some balloons, hearts. You've got a banner that works with the birthday sentiment stamp and a few additional sentiments as well, such as enjoy your day, and you've got the banner die as well. So all of that at a half price deal, £37.10 or $49.48. But if you are platinum, that comes down to $29.68 or $39.58. And what you might want to use it with is your free gift that we still have in stock. While well, stocks last, use your free gift, precious metal card stock with your left fold alphabets. Right, Debbie, lots and lots of ways that you can use the left fold alphabets. One oh. that I absolutely love and you do as well. Yeah, I do. I love, I, I just love a good alphabet because of that personalisation. Um, and these, for me, give you like a, t a, like a twin function kind of thing because they've got that left fold, so they stay connected to your cardstock, but there's nothing to stop you from die cutting again, like you do, Craig, snip them out, and you've got a lovely alphabet that you can then use. Yeah side of that so I like these I, I really think this is Snap. a great one to have and because of that price with everything that you're getting extra in the numbers the 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 dies the the you know the alphabets the the sentiment stamps and dies there's so much wrapped up in it it's absolutely incredible so what I'm going to do is I'm going to spell out because we said we're fast approaching the new year I know that sounds scary, but it really is quite scary. Um, so we're going to have a little hello into the world of um, 2023. Wow. I know. Mm, so I know. why not? Although she's saying that and I'm thinking, what have I done with my L? Hmm. Oh, I've, Somewhere. Had, have I lost? Did I use L this morning? Maybe. An L. Actually, Debbie. Yes. While you're having a look, can I go over something that uh, I've just been told of in course, my ear? Yeah. Yeah, of course you can, yeah. I'll, oh, I found it. Oh, uh, you yeah. found it. you get yourself... You, uh, just just yeah. very quickly, just to no let problem. you know, a free gift. It's gone. It's gone. Has it gone? It's uh, gone. well... However, what we have done is the team, they have said that what we'll do is yesterday's deal you can use again today. So it is uh, £5 off uh, £30. And you can you can use it twice. If you've used it yesterday, you can still use it again today. It's spend thirty and you save five. So whether it's thirty pounds, thirty dollars, thirty euros, you will then save five pounds, five dollars or five euros. What you do need to do with this one is when it comes to the checkout in that promo box, you just need to type in the word festives five. Festive Festive Ah. They're saying to me in my ear, it's Festive 5. I'm looking at it thinking, that's an S, it's a 5. <laughs> in the promo code, just put in Festive 5. Two uses per customer. So if you've used it yesterday, you can absolutely use it today, no problem at all. But just didn't want to leave you with no kind of like little, uh, little gift with the free gift that I sold out for today. So spend 30 and you will then save an additional 5. Festive 5 in the promo box. Sorry, Debbie. No, it's fine. Absolutely fine. Uh, so what I'm just going to do, Craig, is I've, there's lots of ways you can do. You can take a big piece of cardstock and you can go straight into a piece of cardstock and just create okay. your um, your alphabet, your left fold. Um, I'm going in with some nice little squares again, pretty much similar to what I did this morning. Um, so I've taken some squares that are two by two and I've cut myself some contrasting paper. Now, I'm only going to do it with a couple of them because I've got them busy prepped at the side of me, but I want to show you how I how you can do it to create the two-piece. So you're going to take your dotty tape pen and just okay. pop a little bit of dotty um, into the top corner and layer it up because what I want to be able to do is remove this afterwards. So I'm just going to pop a little piece there. I'll do the same with this one. So it's just going to go in that top corner. Do you know this striped paper reminds me of some flannel bedding that we used to have when I was younger? Even you, I had some when I was younger. Did you have some yeah, of that? Yeah, yeah. My God, those square sheets that you used to have to tuck under and, oh, they used to drive them mad. I mean, whoever invented fitted sheets, I could kiss them. Uh, but yeah, literally. Um, <laughs> I know what you mean, yeah. That, that that flannel. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I loved yeah. them, me. I thought they were ace. Absolutely brilliant. Uh, but yeah, so what you've got now is this piece that's cut out all the way around this edge. And this one here has got your score line on. So that score line is where you need to lay down. Excuse me, I do apologise. No, that's okay. No problem. I like how you've got that option <laughs> with the score line. 
to the right, uh, left hand side. And look, I mean, this, I'm, I'm keeping it quite restricted by putting it into a little box. There's nothing to stop you from doing this into a bigger piece if you wanted to. Okay. Um, and again, nothing to stop you from having mm -hmm. it on a little uh, jointy, we'll call it again, jointy angle. I love that word. There we go. So I'm just going to pop those two pieces down. I'll just do it with me, uh, me H and me he. Me H and me he. H and me he. Me H and me he. Me he. Me he. He he. <laughs> He. She's gone now. Oh, I'm sorry. We're taking turns. <laughs> so let's put those through. Now, what that'll do is it'll cut through both of those pieces for me. Um, and then I'm going to use both my um, plastic shim, okay. magnetic shim and the other clear cutting plate because I want it to cut through both pieces this time. Um, and then... I'm going to peel back that piece of cardstock and this is how you can create your background paper. So Good it's tip. just showing you how to do uh, that process if you, were, if you were doing it this way. So again, there's lots and lots of ways that you can do it. Now I'm just going to grab the poker tool okay. and lift off the um, tape like so. Yeah, it's nice to know that just with a tiny little, of a, little bit of adhesive holding in your paper and card, it's a nice yep. way to get it in the exact space that you want. Exactly. And you can use um, low-tack tape if you wanted to. Right. Just a little bit of low-tack tape. Uh, but I find low-tack tape can be quite super strong with Got the you. power yeah. of the Gemini. So for me, um, I prefer to use the uh, dotty tape pen. So it still enables me to create, because you've got that score line that sits um, just... And you literally just fold that over and then score that down but you can see now it lifts that e up mm -hmm, it does. but then this one i'm just going to remove so again either use your scissors and you can use that score line and i'm just gonna make sure because i'll trust me to have done it on stripes but um you get the gist we'll just pop that down and i'm just going to remove that because that will then sit and if you just remove the e you've got yourself a nice little e that you can use for um, another alphabet mm -hmm. project and, and pop that I... somewhere so you could use that somewhere else so that looks really quite effective on some more cardstock but it means then that I've got the perfect piece that will sit there behind the back of it so if I just put that in um, and that way I've not had to strengthen anything or do anything but it fits perfectly it behind um, so that's one way that you can do that and then of course you've got the other way that you can do it as well which is where you just cut it out into your pattern cardstock and then add some strong solid uh -huh. colour and pop that onto the top and strengthen your um, opening and I said the opening it's the it's the mechanism mm -hmm. it's the alphabet that's got that um, piece that just sits out I absolutely love these and that's all we'll do and repeat that with all of your lettering so if I just move over that I've just realized we're seeing time again it's annoyed. honestly it's I'm flying. like and we've got we've got Tom to get back in as well I mean it's crazy so I, I've just brought in I've done my H what I've done with these though Craig is I've popped some acetate on the back and some form on a roll I can say it with you because I know you're gonna burst yeah, out you know song. you're safe with me I'm not saying it in front of Fisher on Friday because I know what she's like. She'll literally, literally, uh, yeah, that makes me. I wonder if they sang it at, at Newcastle. Were you mm. there, Charlotte? Oh, I miss Aww. Charlotte. Oh. What do you mean everybody was there? No, poorly, Charlotte. Did you, did you, did not hear me earlier? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm literally, uh, there was physically no. Physical way on this earth, I could have got and drove up here, uh, or gone and, and stayed in a, a theatre, and it would have been rather selfish of me as well to have done that because I, I would have infected and everybody. And you were looking so forward to it, I Debbie. I've was, been for weeks. I was. I'm so. Oh, do, now go on, Charlotte, rub it. And so, who was there? Who was everybody? Was there? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, I seen John and Laura were there. Oh no, everybody was there. Of course, Sarah yeah, well, was there. What's she Charlotte. like? Oh, honestly. Julia was there as well. Who? Did I miss everybody? Julia. Oh, Julia was there. Your mum was there. Were you there, Johnny? Oh, my God, everybody were there. Oh, <laughs> did you hear Johnny there? I, I did. He was having a, a, a few fizzy pops. <laughs> So I've just sealed into the back now because I wanted to have um, a little piece there that's got 
um, some shaker elements. So cool. So that's all I'm going to do. I'm just going to repeat that with all of these. Um, and literally, in fact, you know what? What a great Let's way to back. create a shaker with your alphabet. Uh, well, yeah, because you can. And, and the yeah. fact that you've got that window enables you to do that. So I'm just popping some different things at the back of mine. I've got some stars. Um, I've just put a bit of gold because, again, bright and cheerful. Um, and it gives that little bit of contrast to the colours that I've used. Um, and you can see I've got little stars inside there. Uh, what should we have under me? Um, let's have a think. What should we have under the L? Because I think something. usually, certainly, I, I'll speak well, for myself to... anyway, when it comes to shakers, I tend to think of larger apertures to do shakers. Never yeah. thinking that, you know, you can nothing do them. Nothing to stop you. Yeah, yeah nothing alphabets. to stop you from doing this, little ones. Uh, it looks really quite effective. Just it make does, sure. Let's go in and, and make sure you seal it in. That's the best bit of advice. A good sealant and it'll stop everything from falling out. Um, and then again, I'll just do the same with my last two. And then we'll start to construct the card. Because again, it's um, it's part personalisation. It is, isn't it? Where yeah. would you go in and find Hello 2023? Exactly. There's not very many places no. that would offer you um, that kind of uh, personalisation. So again, um, it's just thinking along. What is it that you're going to use? What is it that you're going to put there? And if they did, uh, they'd cost you an arm and a leg. Well, yeah, it would, wouldn't it? Especially if you go in those high-end stores. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, definitely. So again, just pop the last one on, and I think I'll go back to some silver sequins for this one. So again. Well, I can say to Rhonda, uh, you are more than welcome to sing away in the comments, but uh, we won't. We'll we'll just listen to you via the form <laughs> of uh, social. <laughs> uh, Jill is saying <coughs> on YouTube. We had them too, Debbie, a blast from the past. Yes. Yeah, with the stripes. The, yeah. Now, what I've done with this, Craig, is I've cut my 2023 out. Wait a minute. Yeah, okay. There, there we, go. we go. I was thinking, what's happened there? Um, and just again, in contrasting colours, this is that Celebrations paper pad, one of my favourites. Um, but I'm going to bring in, and I've made myself a little easel card, um, and I've used our black matte cardstock for this. Okay. Um, and it measures in at eight inches by five. So it's ten by eight, scored in half and half again, and it creates the the uh, the uh, oh, aperture. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh, mm -hmm. Easel. Easel, thank you, Craig. God, my words today. Um, and again, just popped a little piece on the front. And what I'm just going to do is pop on uh, the background. So, again, I'm going to use this gorgeous... Although, it, did you say the freebie's gone now? The freebie... Today's freebie's gone. But what you could do... If, if you are paying today's price, which is 37.10, or you're on one of the other tiers with Club, and, uh, with Club Inspire, if you used yesterday's code, spend 30 and save an additional five, you can use that again today. So today's free gift has gone. It's completely gone, you guys. I've got it all. But to uh, kind of make up for it, what we are allowing you to do is we've brought back yesterday's code. So two uses per customer. So if you've used it yesterday, you can still use it again today. So if you are paying that today's price, you'll get an extra uh, five, well, five pound, five dollars off that, Debbie. Perfect. It's really good, isn't it? It is, isn't it? So I'm just popping this on because I, normally I would lift and I would raise that one, but I'm raising it with my pieces that I've got here. So I'm just going to do literally now con construct, shall I say, construct my card together. So again, it literally is all about what it is that you're going to personalise, what it is that you're going to say to someone. Um, and again, I think what I'll do is I'll just. Layer some like this. Debbie, I'm so sorry. Can I just quickly say? Of course you can, yeah. The will's so big deal. It's live on our website oh, right amazing. now. amazing. So gift tags, everything like that are across live on our website. So it's so, so grateful for uh, your patience. It is live across on our website. The big deal's there. The tags are there. If you're like, I really, really want them, now's the time. Head across crafterscompanion.co.uk.com.eu. That's where you're going to go. They're live right now. Amazing. Last. Absolutely fabulous. I'm so excited because I thought I'd miss out, but I don't think I'm going to miss out now. No, I don't think you will. <laughs> they are wonderful, aren't they? I really, really am excited about this this today. It's been fabulous. It really has. 
So as I'm doing, uh, Craig is, and I know I'm gonna. I'm, I think I, what I'll do is I'll stop and I'll show you my finish one. But Pick it up. literally, just layer these pieces out. Again, I've got my balloons. You've got your stars. Literally, just layer all that out. Again, I would probably think about and place where you're popping everything. Uh, but I'll show you the one that I've finished with because literally, all I've done is popped them in the background, lifted so that I've got the shaker oh, yeah. element showing through, added a couple more balloons and just drawn on the extra little pieces. And then to create the easel part, I said that I kept that bit flat, yeah. but I didn't with the 2023. So I put I these see. two pieces on flat and raised these two so that it enables to have that construction form in terms of an easel stopper, or in my little That's words, fab. a flopper stopper. Flopper stopper. Stops that, the flopper stopper. But hello 2023, because we're only about three, four week away. Three? Something like three that. Three weeks, yeah. 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 Must be what, uh, so what's that, about 20? Maybe round about, is it maybe round about 25 days or something like that? Yeah, something like something that. Something like that along the lines. Scary to think, isn't it's it? terrifying. 23, where's the year gone? Right, Theo, so that was your Leffold Alphabet collection with 93 elements, £37.10, $49.48. Again, so we mentioned a moment ago on that today's price. If you're paying then, of course, you will get today's new gift. The uh, cardstock sold out, or you guys have got it all, so therefore you spend 30 you get an additional five off. If you are platinum, $29.68 or $39.58. But what we are going to do before we have a little bit of a break and we welcome Tom back in, we're going to jump back to Debbie where we're going to have a look at demo of the show, Debbie. Well, it's another nice, easy one. We've got uh, three, I think. I think we've done three. So did we start with... Yes, we started with these. Yeah. So number one was our number 40. Got you, um, yeah. Uh, card fold using those um, stencils and dies. So that's number one. Okey-doke. Number two was our little dinky abacus. So number two. Look at and that. And then number three. Hello to 2023. Oh, it's going to be a tough one for yep. me. There you go. Such so one, two one. or three, you decide. Brilliant. So you have a few moments. Uh, I believe as well within Monday Makers, I think we are going to do demo of the month because the... I'm going to say they ran out of time. Someone might say they forgot. Anyway, so they are going to be having it. <laughs> and then they've just landed me in it by saying it wasn't them. Oh, well. <laughs> Jamie and George, I, I assume I apologise. They probably forgot. They probably what forgot. What are they like? Oh, it's not, oh, it's not Becky and Lily's fault. No, no, Jamie and George, Jamie and George. <laughs> but not to worry, joking aside, yeah, we're going to be doing that again in Monday Maker. So... Now's the opportunity to get across to the website. Will so products are live, including the big bundle, including the tags. Do you know what? We're going to speak to Tom in a moment, so let's take this opportunity. Have a look in Club Inspire, but go, go, go! Welcome to Club Inspire, the crafters' companion community where you can feed your crafty obsession. Join our fantastic loyalty club today and receive 20% of your first order. We'll also give you 250 points to help get you started. Other benefits of joining Club Inspire include exclusive special offers and discounts for Club Inspire members only, exclusive sneak peek previews of brand new product launches, and of course the Club Inspire community group on Facebook where you can access exclusive content such as downloads, offers and inspiration and of course you can chat and share your makes with other members. You'll receive one point for every pound, dollar or euro you spend and the more points you receive, the more benefits you'll unlock. So what are you waiting for? Sign up, join the club and start rewarding yourself today. makes Crafters TV so special is uh, you guys. It's really special because the the experts are really experts. They're they're um, really skilled at what they do, and they want to make sure that the audience also improves on their skills. Crafters TV is so special because you've got together a really sort of key group of people um, and people that are very passionate about the product. Crafters TV is 
so special because it's a unique community that we have with each other where we can learn and grow and communicate with each other. Community, the family spirit, the education, everything to do with craft. We are all like-minded people who share a passion. I love all the inspiration the demonstrators bring and all the knowledge for us out here. What makes Crafters TV so special, 100% is the interaction. No other crafting TV channel or show has the same interaction. I love the community, I love chatting live, uh, I think that's the best part and uh, it's gone beyond crafting because we've become friends. It feels to me to be a really, really close relationship with our customers and viewers. You guys make us feel like we're part of your family. I've never been on the show before, but one of my friends who I did meet from CCTV encouraged me and I was on the craft along. A massive team of people and I think they've all got their role to play uh, and it just brings everything together. It allows us to do our job and just love it. Ah, oh, the people obviously, the people not just here at Crafts Companion, uh, but the viewers that watch us, I mean everybody. We have this real magical essence about it. Bye for now. Bye. I knew we were going to be busy as soon as it went live on the website and it's so, so, so busy. It's been incredible. What did you just say, Johnny? All the gremlins have gone at last. Hooray! Stop feeding them after midnight. Don't get them <laughs> wet, all that sort of stuff. But yeah, it is eventually, it's live across on the website. Within those couple of minutes, it's been so, so busy. And I'm not surprised. Just briefly, you know, we are going to be having a look at the plantable books as well as a few new items. What is it about the plantable books? What is it that does? Oh, it's its name, doesn't it? That's it, yeah. Books. So you put the story in the ground or, or the book in the ground and it grows the main character. That's brilliant. Uh, we have carrot, lettuce, basil, dill and parsley. So you've got loads to choose from or there's bundles where you can have all those five or shop and change them. So yeah, there's loads of opportunities. So if you had them in your basket recently with the gremlins, get them purchased now. Absolutely. Absolutely, you can do it. And then what you can also do as well, so the free gift has gone, you guys have got it all, but don't forget what we are doing is what was available yesterday, where you spend 30 and get an additional five off. Well, if you're going to go for this big bundle, or maybe even the smaller ones, as long as your basket is over 30, 30 pounds, 30 dollars, 30 euros, you're going to get an additional five pound, five dollars, five euros that? off. So that's good yeah. now. Yeah, okay, maybe the free gift's gone, but then you're going to get that extra discount as well. So we're going I'm going to go over the full bundle in a moment because that's what so many of you have been waiting for. Yeah. So the full bundle, £104.47 or $147.49, that of course is the today's price. You're going to be saving 15% on that. A few of the items are brand new items, world exclusive, not seen them before. But if you're platinum, that sure. comes down to £83.58 or $117.99. When you go into checkout, go into promo code and in capitals put festive five you'll get that additional five off when it comes to uh, your total in the end and it's mega. it Absolutely is mega. mega so what do we get in this big so, uh, bundle uh, let me just give me a second some water to tell you all about there's, what I get loads, in there. there's <laughs> loads so the first the big mega bundle we've got the five books so we have the basil book here uh, we have dill and then we have lettuce and then carrot, which is, I don't know, my, my favourite between carrot and lettuce, I'm not too sure. Yeah. Um, I love the story with lettuce. Yeah, it is a good one. Uh, with this big bundle, you get the four books. Yeah. There is an option if you want uh, just five books on their own, but within this bundle, you've got these four books that Tom just showed Brilliant. us. Brilliant. And then we have the exciting cards here. So we'll start off with the grass cards. Let's go for it. Yeah. So these are really cool because um, you cut the lawn. Uh, well, sorry, you cut the lawn. If you cut your lawn. <laughs> we cut our lawn, but this is made of 50 50% grass. So um, just grass cuttings when you cut your lawn, we're putting paper in there. Um, so it's 50% paper and 50% cuttings. And uh, you can see the nice congrats there. It's got a blank inside so you can write any, whatever message you want on there. Some mm -hmm. grass puns if you want to. You could do, yeah. You've got a bit more information about the card. So we have a congrats card here. Um, and then we have a happy birthday one. Brilliant. I'm just getting the angle right, Charlotte. Sorry about that. There you go. <laughs> and then a thank you one here as well. 
So these are lovely, lovely designs they at the really same time. They really are, aren't they? That was really great. Are. In each envelope, uh, sorry, to each card, you get a free envelope at the same time. And it's got the nice craft uh, look It does. It, it has that flat. craft card effect, doesn't it? Yeah. But it just complements the card as well. You oh, know, that's the word I was looking for. Compliment. Yeah, yeah. you got it. Yeah. You know, nothing wrong with <laughs> a, a white envelope, but when you've got a lovely card like that, oh. the craft, the natural, you want something to complement. Um, and I know we've still got more, but a normal pen and that you can write in it as yeah, well. Yeah, normal, normal pen, pen, anything. A permanent Brilliant. pen or, or, or a roller pen. It's a really nice. Uh, it's, it's a smooth surface on the grass one. It is um, actually, yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah it's lovely. Nice smooth one. Well, yeah, so, lovely. And then, so going on, so there's the cards. So these are the exciting ones. I love these cards. I think um, everyone let's has. Let's start off with our, my, my favourite one here. Is Poodle the Red Nosed Reindeer? This is made of 50%. Sorry, 50%. I'm going on a grass one. 20% <laughs> elephant poo. Yep, you heard it. So um, mm -hmm. we just wash all the nasties out. It's got just got the hay left in there, and the rest is recycled card. Um, and it's vegetable-based ink, and we print them all in Leicester at my family printing business. Right, OK, it's yeah, all, all in-house, all in-family. So then we have our next one here. We have, have a poop birthday. Um, this is another lovely, lovely card. Um, and then the next one after that, we have our... Uh, we have a happy birthday. This card is made from elephant poo. A really cool poo emoji there at the same time. It's, it's funny, it's funny, it's quirky, <laughs> but yeah, what you've made with it. And then we have happy birthday, an elephant has pooped into your card. Oh, there you go, sorry. It's quite hard to get it backwards. See, yeah, it see, yeah it's back to front, upside down, don't worry, yeah, we all do that. Yeah, 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 don't uh, worry, we still <laughs> all do that. So you go, and then also, we're not just stopping there, we've no, got even not. more items in the bundle. It's we mega. do, don't we? So we have our large uh, gift tag. So these are great because you've got your, say if you're getting your gift for Christmas, and then you've wrapped it, and then you always like to put a little personalised message on there. We have these, no, there you go, there he is. Look at that. Nutcracker, I get right way around again. My head's backwards at the moment. Uh, so these are, uh, when you, you can use these, write a little message in there and then plant them and grow wildflowers. That's so smart. And Being if you look at the back that. there, you can write any message and at the bottom it just says, plant me, I grow wildflowers. And we also give these an extra tag. It's a nice little cotton it uh, is. Christmas uh, Christmas kind of um, little link yeah. on there. So and then with them, pictures. you're it's not already... having to write that message about you have to plant or you can plant them, you can or text them to say you can plant them. It's written there for them yeah. to know, plant them. So that's ten of these large ones that you're getting. Yeah. So there's five designs and you get two of each. Um, and yeah, they're brilliant. They really so are. We have like our medium sized ones. So these are the character ones. Uh, we have uh, um, the elf ones here. I don't know if you can see them. Oh, uh, that way. No, that way. All of these. So are there's so the elf there one. Go. Um, and then we have a snowman one. There's a bit of soil on these. Sorry, they've been in the. Uh, oh, in the that's right. So here's a good way to show it. Here, they're <laughs> going to be going in the soil. So. And then we have Mrs. Christmas. Uh, we have Father Christmas. And then we have the reindeer one, which are really cute designs at the same time. And again, on the back there, it says plant me mm -hmm. and grow wildflowers. So it helps, helps the person receiving the gifts. And then so we have ten the, of them. Ten of them as well. And then we have another ten. Uh, these are the Christmas items. So we have holly, we have reindeer, uh, another reindeer. So you can see two of each with love, like mistletoe. You know, you can dangle these and give a bit of a kiss, eh, Craig? Well, well, you, you could do, you could do, <laughs> couldn't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then um, we have a Christmas tree one at, at the same time. So these are lovely. They and are. these are quite a nice size as well. You can get a nice message and a name on there at the same mm -hmm. time. You know what I, even I'm thinking as well, Tom, as crafters, on a little 4x4 four four or 5x5 five five card, we could use that as a topper instead. Just one little glue dot or foam pad to hold it in place, Perfect, yeah. give the card, and then they can take that one off and then plant it words afterwards. Yeah. So a tag or a card. But you've got 10 of them as well, so that's 30 tags in total. And we're still not finished. We're still not finished. No. Right. What else have we got? One of my favourite items is, wait for it, e, the carrot pen. It's so smart. The wooden carrot pen. Sorry, I'm forgetting like, the really cool aspects of there. The wooden, beech the wooden, wood. Yeah. Um, and it's really nice. It's a ballpoint pen. Um, and these are just amazing. And if you end up getting one, you need to cl keep close attachment to it. Because mm -hmm. I think a lot of people will try and steal this from you. Oh, they definitely will. Because the last time you were here, you, were, you kindly brought in a, a lovely selection for everyone to view. Oh, yeah, yeah. How many did you go home with? Well, I had there's like a little thieves at the Crafters Companion HQ, so I think it went over like two like from about 30. They all wanted yeah. the pens, yeah. That's all right, you yeah. know, no, 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 what are you joking? Um, the, the teams loved them, everyone, even yeah. Sarah loved these as well. Mm -hmm. um, Absolutely. And they're just really easy to write with, and they're nice and lightweight at the same time. They are, they really are, it's really nice, and it's a nice one to hold as well when you're writing. Yep. That's surely not it, is it? Um, no. No. 
What yeah. else are we getting? What Something new today. So this is really nice. This is the new, this is the first of Crafters Companion. Um, I, last time I was on the show, I really wanted to listen to the feedback that yeah. the team did at Wilso. What, what can we create for the crafters today to make a world first and also for, for you guys to, to be able to create your own items with? So we came up with some lovely A4 paper here. So it comes with like the front um, so a message on here to so how to plant. But what this is, is plantable paper. This is plain paper. So you're getting 10 sheets of 300 gram uncoated sheets. Um, and there's probably about 1,000 sheets in this one sheet, which is crazy. That's phenomenal. And you can cut them into strips. You can fold them. Debbie made a lovely envelope earlier. Um, so I'm not too sure if it's been shown at all. Uh, uh, we're dead, yeah. There you yeah. go. Be beat me to it. She's actually going to get us. Oh, Debbie, us you want to come to the Wilso team? I'm like, I'm going to get you across. <laughs> Thank you, Debbie. Thank you. So we've made a lovely envelope with this yeah. paper. It creases really Really nicely and it folds really nicely because it's kind of handmade paper and it's recycled paper um, and look at it, it just looks great mm -hmm. doesn't it it really really does and even Debbie same with us when we first seen you Debbie said the same when it comes to this so make it and you you literally just pop it under soil that's you it yeah. don't need to do anything that's it and you don't it doesn't need to be big like this no, no. could be a little container just yeah. on uh, the side of uh, yeah, like a takeaway tub yeah um, so you don't have to have a garden to grow any of these items you can grow them in a, a germinate them in a, in a kind of a, a takeaway tub and then put them into a pot but it depends lettuce is nice because it grows outwards mm -hmm. and, and the basil and and the herb do yeah and then also the uh the carrot uh books really nice because you can pull them out so they don't work really well in the planter mix a bit of sand in there at the same time and uh it's just a lovely way to get children outside and also it's such a you're not just buying a book here you're buying a moment you that is such a lovely yeah. way to explain it, it and think about it it's a lovely way to spend time with you yourself and your child or your niece and nephew mm -hmm. five minutes every day watering get them away from the computer screens get them in the nature get make them made to get messy getting their fingers nice yeah. and dirty and growing their own understanding where the vegetable or herbs come from and you were uh, you were explaining and actually what johnny just said in our ear it's it's right enough it's a good way to explain that your fruit your vegetables they don't just come from a food supermarket yeah. you know as the tesco's or the american ones or european ones you know you're actually growing it you know even they grow yeah. but you're doing it uh, naturally yourself and you're watching it grow teaching them patience as well this is everything's it, yeah. perfect still tastes delicious they grow different so you get you know like the trouser shaped legs that you can get from yeah. they're non-gmo seeds all our seeds are non-GMO, so they grow lovely different shapes and sizes. Um, and what's nice about it, you don't ha you don't lose the book when you when no. you when you're reading the story, and then you plant the back page or the front page. You don't lose any of the story. Um, the inside back page has instructions to cut down the dotted line, um, and they can cut them into strips. You don't have to plant the whole page. You can cut, say cut uh, half a page for this season, um, or sorry, May next year, and then they can plant another half of the page for the year after probably after May time when the frost okay. is gone, so they can get excited for it. Mm -hmm. It's a lovely thing to do together. It really, really is. And it's, I was saying to you actually just before wow. we went live there, is even for me, even I just thought, plant the page. And I never thought you were like saying, you know, just cut it up, chop it up. Yeah, you know, yeah. you don't have to do that whole lot. Maybe give uh, a strip to, you know, um, you know, the different children or your nephew and your nieces, you can be doing all of yep. that, of course. So that's all in the big bundle. What I do have to say... Yeah, this is insane amount. This is absolutely insane. So this has gone crazy. One third of your uh, wildflower card, because it is a substantial card, is it's gone. A third is gone. So if you want to get that on its own, like many of you have, what I think many have been doing as well, Tom, is they're going for the big bundle, but they're putting an extra one of these in, oh. which I wouldn't be surprised. It's a great idea. And it because is. of the oversize as well, you, you can make cards out there, like that envelope, and then you can make a card and an envelope at the same time out of one you sheet. Could. And you've got 10 sheets in there. So it's two two five millimetres by 320 millimetres. Um, so you've got quite a large sheet there to create whatever you want out of it. Yeah, you really, really can. 21.84 for your here in the UK, or 25 pound, 25 dollars, sorry, 64 for you guys stateside. But if you are platinum, that's going to then come down to 17.47 or 20 dollars 51. Oh. So within these ones here, all of these, good thing to point out as well is for you guys stateside, it's available for you, but you can only get it with us, That's Crafters it. TV. That's it, yeah. yeah. So really good to know, really, really good. And what's great with the States as well is we've always wanted to get out there and it's a lot of logistics for us as a small business to, to 
to be able to get out. Yeah, it's so difficult to get out there. Really? But for us to be able to uh, go through Sarah's route at Crafters mm -hmm. Companion and be able to offer our amazing products to the USA market is insane and we're so appreciative of the feedback we get from everyone yeah. so thank you very much. Well, the, the feedback today you know all over the globe has just been incredible which we knew it would be yeah. but it has been absolutely insane certainly for you guys stateside as well but it's a lovely way to cross over paper crafting oh. and of course going into the garden afterwards. Yep. What we do need to say because we're just about coming to the end of the show but the other thing that we knew would be busy as soon as the gremlins went across on our website was the tags. Yeah, the tags. Absolutely loving the gift tags. Oh, we've had such lovely feedback. Uh, uh, it's just such a lovely way to add a, another cool element to your gift or your present for Christmas mm -hmm. and then be able to plant the gift tag so it's just not thrown away into the, the bin and not recycled. Yeah, you're right. Just chuck it into ground in, in the ground instead and then it grows wildflowers. And it's not just supporting the nature, it's supporting the bees. Um, it's great. And you know, look how nice that looks. So even, you know, just attaching it with a tiny little bit of adhesive, you won't need much at all. Maybe you want to do a little mat and layer with car stock, but that's it. Turn your tag into a topper, into your envelope. You can see done, dusted, but you've got your three packs of your tags. So one's large, one's medium, one's small. Ten in each, it's giving you 30 tags. Oh, brilliant. It's great. And the lovely designs. And you can see the seeds in the paper as well. So it's a real nice visual aspect to it mm -hmm. as well. Yeah, so yeah, it's really great. Is. And I think at first as well, it looks like recyclable card or paper. That's it, yeah. Which obviously the element it is, but of course it's all the seeds that are through it. That's it. And it's nice. It's a thick card as well. It it's is. A 300 gram and like you've got a nice flick to it, as you probably can hear that. Um, and it's just got a nice tactile feeling to it. And um, it's just another lovely story to, to sit down. And if you want to be the best auntie or uncle, and if you exactly. want to keep giving your kids presents, it's getting them outside, understanding nature, get these. Yeah, get them. That's exactly it. And that's exactly what so many of you are doing. Those that aren't going for the big bundle um, initially, many of you, and I was reading in the comments, you went for the books and that the last time you were here. And what you've done is you're going for the wildflower tags and the cardstock. Yeah. But mostly, as I was saying, those that are going for that big bundle have popped an additional uh, card selection of the wildflower and many are popping in extra tags as well because it's really really handy to have so with these ones 23.99 or 32 dollars 49 platinum comes down to 19.19 or 25 dollars 99 right we do have demo of the show when it comes to debbie and the result and i i couldn't call oh. this one i couldn't call it was it a difficult one it was yeah. a very difficult one that's for sure but it is demo three from debbie so yeah so masterclass demo of the show is number three you're ready to see it right now just there live shot <laughs> right at the side how fab is that one so that is going it's to like go. The hand from Adam's yeah. family, just holding the product for the <laughs> lady. Uh, have you seen that on Netflix yet? Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday's it's brilliant. Wednesday. I'm really enjoying I've started it. Started to watch it. It's good. Johnny's not started yet. It's yeah. good. Really do enjoy it's that. It's a difficult oh. one when you get into. It. You start watching one, then you need to watch another one, and then before you know it, three hours have gone it. by. That's it. It's gone. Yeah. That, that's what it's like for us crafters. We're going to make one thing, and before you know it, then we're sitting hours later. Debbie can vouch for me on that one, that is for <laughs> sure. Um, thank you for all your comments. So that's going to go up against Debbie again and Monday Makers. Don't forget, we are going to do demo of the month, because the guys ran out of time the other day, so we're going to have a look at that as well. Monday Makers, so Debbie's got a lovely selection of things that she's going to be showing you. We've got incredible deals as well. You're going to be back as well, I believe, yep. later on as well. I will be. Monday makers uh, what I am going to say you know aside from the gremlins in the system everything is up and running and this little small space of time from going live on the website to right now it's gone bonkers so if you're humming in hand totally understand certainly that big bundle with notes are considered purchase however I think exactly as Tom was explaining you yep. know using them with the kids building those memories what a lovely way to be using them so think ahead but we'll have a look again when it comes to Monday makers everything's live the big bundle wildflower papers the tags it's all there for you to get on the uh, website to check out crafterscompanion.co.uk.com.eu if you are watching live we will see you in a few hours time for you guys stateside sarah's away to do an hsn facebook live which funny enough you might just find a familiar face 
dotting through there as well. So if you are watching live, give me half an hour. I'm waiting to dot across the pond to oh, no. America. Uh, I've got a <laughs> private jet and everything. Yeah, absolutely. Off. I'm off. And then uh, we will then be back for Monday Makers as well. So take that time, check out your baskets, get these incredible deals that Debbie's been showing you and Tom's brought from Wilso. And we will see you in a couple of hours' time. See you later. Cheers, guys.